the Bunny Motor Club. That's right. We are going to go from vehicles to mechs. And in version 17.1, there is the capability of having up to 12 mechs at a time instead of the regular eight. And on top of that, four battle armor points as well. So I'm very, very excited to check this out. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we are working with. So this is a brand new, brand new campaign. As you can see, currently our funds are at 2.404. You're probably wondering, that's a weird starting fund. And the only reason for that is because we went to the hiring hall and we basically hired out every single bunny that was there because I typically like to have bunny pilots that are actually occupiable by real bunnies but we kind of had to make do so if we stop over at the barracks you'll notice that we've got hb of course and we got four placeholders and then we have two that are currently sort of i don't know what you would call this omni capable they can do both mech and also the uh the v piloting but until we can kind of replace these i'd like to replace these as quickly as possible so there are two bunnies right now that are V only. So eventually we'll be using them potentially less and less. I'm not too sure. But with that in mind, I would like to have some volunteers. I can see that right now I have Amiel and Virigo, which is Virgent, interested in battle armor. Debs said that he was interested in being a bunny as well. Um, that having been said, feel free to toss your name in the hat. Uh, over in our mech bay right now, this is going to be our starting lineup. So we had two mechs right now, the Wasp and the Locust, the 1E, which is my favorite version. The Wasp I took down just because I figure we're going to start with no mechs at all. But that having been said, the Locust is sort of like a backup that we'll have in case we don't have any bunnies that can actually pilot all the Vs that we have. So let's go in and take a look at our starting roster. Yeah, so obviously we kept one of the mechs here in the Locust 1E, but in our vehicle bay, we have quite a spread. So right now we've got a Ballista, believe it or not. So we actually start with sniper artillery for once. That is crazy. So we actually have artillery on the board. And mind you, this is going to be bunnies with rather low gunnery skill and low tactics. So this makes me a little bit nervous because friendly fire is on. We've also got the LTV4 hover tank. Let me tell you, this is going to be a really interesting campaign for me because after all, I know very little about the Vs. All I know is I like Shieldtrons, I like Long Toms, I like LRMs, all of that stuff. When it comes to everything else, I am so, so noob. So this is gonna be very interesting indeed. We also have an Allsvin, so this allows the APC to actually carry units into battle, like battle armor. We have a Scimitar, with has an AC5, and then we've also got the Savannah Master, very, very, very fast hover little beast here. It basically looks like a tugboat on a on a floating pillow of some kind, yeah, like a hovercraft. And then for our battle armor, we have the standard inner sphere battle armor. So not the most illustrious start, but you know what? These are back in the days when the bunnies gathered around the fireplace and decided that they wanted to roam around the inner sphere in their motor club hb you want to know how to give yourself a bad panic attack uh, i mean i don't need much help with that but let me know we have no armor like at all on any of the tanks well that's why we need a lot of volunteers let's put it that way so you're probably wondering where we started i have never seen this place before uh, we're currently in as you can see we just started we're currently on a planet called arn way in the armpit of the inner sphere <laughs> And here's the thing. So as much as I want to go from rags to riches or rags to more illustrious rags, I there are a few things that I would like to accomplish in this career. So one, obviously go from these to all mechs would be great. And then I want to get the juggernaut. That is a an absolute must. I absolutely want to get the juggernaut and try it out because that thing I believe is in Solaris. You have to buy it. So we have to save money. That's going to be a bit of a challenge, but I think we can do it if we put our noggins together. And that thing has 20 weapon support hard points. So I absolutely want to check that out. I would also like to build a few unique mechs and then also potentially ally ourselves with the Federated Sons because we tried the Paladin and it's so good. <laughs> so with that in mind, we are out in Arn. 
we're probably going to take a few missions here and then start migrating our way over to the federated uh the, the federated territory over in the east yeah and here are our barracks so we can go ahead and assign some bunnies as we go if we go over to the store there's actually a few things that we can pick up immediately right we've got a yutake which can also carry battle armor into combat that's only 165,000. i think that's amazing so we'll go ahead and pick up you know what let's pick up a couple why not when i know we're supposed to save money for the juggernaut but let's just be real oh oh we have space issues <laughs> go figure we have space issues uh let's store it yeah we'll send it to storage okay well we're not picking up another one right away and <laughs> That was fast. Well, th yeah, that's all they've got. That's all they've got in the store then, in that case. I was hoping... I totally forgot that you need spaces. I'm not used to actually buying vehicles in the shop, as you probably know. Out of all of this, though, there is also, I believe, I saw it, a location designator. I want to pick that up early on, just because they have been a little difficult to collect over time. And I think that's all we will do here, yeah? space issues great problems to have yeah especially in a game like this well now that we are stacked and ready there isn't really a lot of balancing so typically in the beginning of the career the first thing we'll do is head over to the mechs and rebalance them i guess we can rebalance the locust as a backup but we're primarily going to start with the bees we now have six so that's great but we also have a seventh slot which i guess is for battle armor so we'll keep that in mind i guess if we were to change anything i'd like to I mean, we actually have very little. We don't really have cores. This is from pulling down that wasp earlier. And I, there's not really too much that we can do to this. I guess we can get a battle armor handhold, but we kind of have the Yutake and we've got the APC. Jump jets don't really want it on this right now. And as far as weapons go, I mean, I kind of feel like we can... If we were to armor up, how much do we need to free up? I don't know if that's even really necessary. So I think I'll just leave it stock if I'm perfectly honest. This is a good mech. I could pull off a small laser or something, but I don't, I don't know if it's necessary. So with that in mind, we're starting with 1.249 million, which is crazy. That's, we're actually over 1 million. It's amazing. So if we head over to the command center, let's see what we got to start with. We've got our recovery in a polar biome. We have a battle in a polar biome. I like this at half a skull. That seems awesome. Battle in a polar. Destroy base battle on highlands okay these are all very very nice to us they're not going to destroy us immediately but there is one thing to do if we advance one day then we get to get uh not that we also get the crate so i'm going to take the crate obviously it comes with a mech in it we will drop the mech and sell it for money because we want to start with oh it's, yeah oh too bad i guess we will drop the cicada okay <laughs> But we get the tags, we get the narc beacons. That's awesome. Light AC2, that's great. That what is this? Oh, it's a cicada with a PPC and an ER large laser and a beagle active probe. Wow, that's a really nice drop that we got. I mean, if we drop this out, we're going to get all that equipment. That's crazy. Honestly, you keep the cicada. Here's the thing. We are starting from nothing. So we're only just getting the backup, yeah? We're, we've got the locust. I'm actually going to drop this down because we're actually starting from Vs. This is just sort of the backup in case we get a bunny that cannot go into a V, then we have something to use, but we're not gonna default to this one. So in fact, just to avoid any confusion, this is just the uh, the intern, okay? This is the, <laughs> this is gonna be the bunny intern. Eventually we will eject them from the, oh, that's, that feels bad. I've been there before, oof. That is starting from nothing. It Well, you know, we're talking about nothing, nothing. So let's go over to the command center and let's see what we can do. We've got Battle and Polar. I think you can't start any better than that. And since we're in Vs, we don't really have to worry about any cooling or anything like that. So this is, quite frankly, this is very odd to me. So let's get, we've got six slots to begin with. They're all Omni slots. We can put whatever we want. So we've got our Savannah Master as well. And we have our Yutake. And we have our battle armor. Wow, I wonder what two Yutakes are going to do. I guess we can have... Huh. That's going to be interesting. <laughs> but don't you only have two battle armor slots? That start would be basically impossible. I think the battle armor slot starts you out with more. I'm pretty sure. Or, or better yet, I think these slots right here potentially can take them. I don't remember what they were like. So I'm going to put myself 
Actually, let's put Dud into the Ballista just because he actually has gunnery. We'll take HB and toss him into a Yutake. We'll take Omega and toss him into a Yutake because I doubt that we're really going to see too much combat there. Uh, we got Dertz. Hopefully the bunnies are going to survive. Amiel said he wanted to be a battle armor pilot, so we'll toss him in the Inner Sphere Standard. These are all stock. We got Dertz, Ronin, and Serve Cold, who is our scout. Beautiful. Here we go. Half Skull difficulty battle in a polar biome. We've got them, bunnies. Right out in the open. These guys are amateurs. Get eyes on them and take them out. Good hunting, bunnies. Olivera out. All right, so... Oh. The Starling couldn't best us. You think you can? Bold. Stupid, but bold. Second Canopian Fusiliers. Show this fool the error of his ways. I mean, I don't know about error. I mean, it's kind of what we've got to start with, yeah? Canopians, yes, we're fighting against them. Don't jinx him. Just get me close enough to swarm. You got it. Well, let's go and find out where Amiel even you. is. Nobody knows the trouble no he's seen. Well, we've got... Definitely want to get him in a Yutake, if possible. Can we mount on up and get in? Do I select these things from way up here? I don't remember. Oh, they're over here, actually. So let's get our Yutake. Actually, you know what? Since we still have some evasion, I think it would be best if we reserve down to one. Force them to counter reserve. All right, perfect. Let us get this Yutake back. So he can be right next to where Amiel is. Still have some evasion. We'll expose the rear with Omega. And hold. Quick, get the catnip deploying. Tactical catnip. <laughs> hey, Oxford, welcome. That sounds like a total, total baller plan, if you ask me. Can we can we do this here? Or do we click up here? Oh, there we go. I think this works. I think it lands, if I recall. Oh, that is so cool. Check that out. Amiel getting onto the Utake. Love it. I love that we've got duels of them. Oh, and we have really good tank terrain here. <laughs> really not the best. I mean, that's basically what served us in right now. Hold, hold, hold. All right. They're trying to scout with their Vs. Oh, order. how interesting. Well, let's Awaiting see. We've order. got our Savannah. Let's get Serve Cold out there. If anyone's going to be able to scout. So we're actually going to... It's like playing World of Tanks. Oh my god. It can go right over the mountain. This is insanity. Pedal. I should probably be careful because this speed can get us into a lot of trouble. Or get served into a lot of trouble. Look at that. Oh, he's so cute. My God, look at this thing. Isn't this cozy looking? It's almost like... I don't know, you could... Like the tugboat of the polar biome. <laughs> it's a hovercraft. It's like a 15 movement or something. I mean, that's it's crazy. It's awesome. I love it. What do we have in front of us? This was their scout, the J. Edgar, only with a tag. All right, I'll take that. And a Galleon with a medium pulse and two mediums. Ah, you can't touch us. Heck yes. Being in with an empty Utake. After all, HB's in this one. They think that we've got battle armor loaded in this, but they are going to be so sad when they find out that there's nothing at all. Well, let's see. We've got the Galleon. We can definitely, we definitely want to get rid of that thing. There can really be only Bunny Vs on the battlefield. We really don't want anyone else out there. What kind of giant monstrosity is this? A hornet. All right, this is the kind of start I like, and he lost his PPC. <laughs> oh, this is boating very well for us, yeah? Waiting for orders. Serve cold. He's the brave one. It's a medium laser and a propulsion unit with a cockpit sandwich between. Oh, I like sandwiches. Standing the by. bunnies love sandwiches. It seems like this is the right play. Oh, three evasion. I do see that there is an enemy over oh, there. We oh. want to be a little bit cautious. Let's get our scimitar to tuck back or better yet or we're in cover right now maybe we just hold this position can we land anything oh our ac5 has a pretty decent chance to ping it just soften him up wow i'm very impressed already Commander. this bodes yeah. well for the bunny league don't you think and of course we've got sniper artillery send high explosive right at him from above Oh, all right, heck yes, he's got 35 left. Oh, this is going to be an easy campaign. I don't know what you guys were thinking. When even a hornet seems terrifying. It's not terrifying. It's silly looking. Very silly looking. All right, we're coming out. This is geothermal. That's extra heat. Uh, heat does turn into damage, I think, for V, so we want to be a little bit cautious. I guess we'll limit the line of sight and come on down with deaths. I know it's not the fastest deaths. I'm so sorry, and we're hoping to hit the front. 
And we do, heck yes! And splash one for the career with decks from above. You gotta love that, heck yes. The beautiful, it's basically like Serve Cold is in the Chaffee, the tier five World of Tanks American Light. That Chaffee just hiding in the underbrush, ready to absolutely devastate everybody with this incredible spotting distance. Yeah. Uh, what do we got here, though? Inner Sphere Battle Armor Reserve. So they have three right now. We're doing so, so well. I just don't know what this is. I'm a little nervous. And I get the first hit of the run. Dark Strike. Oh, oh, they hit HB. Little did they know there was no battle armor in there. Heck yes. We pulled the fast one over them, yeah? It's a walking egg. Side slip on basically every pilot is basically a given. Uh, well, I don't know. We need to plan that one day, one day, we too shall be able to essentially have a mech, so I don't know if I want to... I guess you can retrain bunnies, right? HB, the Chaffee can actually kill things, unlike the Savannah <laughs> Hey, this J. Edgar just has a tag. I don't know what you're talking about. We have more damage than that J. Edgar. Oh, but that J. Edgar is pretty useful. Ooh, he's got a bap. How many basically's can I fit into one sentence? I don't know. Why don't you try? All right, so they've all moved, which means we are now 100% safe. There is no way anything Better. bad could happen to any of us. So there is that Hornet. Uh, I want this to be even worse for them. So let's get HP. We'll start this off correctly. There can only be some bunnies with this capability to use their legs. And we shall lock from here. Bring him down to zero. Heck yes, this guy's so screwed. You know, I feel anywhere. bad for him. I really, really feel bad for him because, ooh, 28. Oh, not that. We want the Hornet, right? So that sniper here, and there's the Hornet. Shot out with high explosive. All right, we got a breach. Look how easy this is. All right, we'll ping the Scorpion. Not even worried about this guy. Take a look at this. Oh, it's so sad. He only has 30 armor. I feel bad for this guy. Scimitar. All right, look at this clean line of sight at the enemy. Gotta love that. It's something that we don't always have, but we'll take it. Uh, let's see. Do we have a better line of sight at the Hornet? <laughs> there. Okay. And not that. We'll try to connect with him. Stack into the left, and we open up the front. My god, the incredible firepower of this lance already able to absolutely devastate that Hornet. Poor, poor guy. When they were hit, yes, the trick is hitting them. Oh, take a look at this. Look at this. Oh, yes. Now, simultaneously, we deliver our payload straight into the enemy. So let's get our Savannah Master ready to go. Full six evasion. Absolute insanity. With the incredible firepower of of an Oz Scout. All right, we've got the firepower of an Oz Scout. Gotta start somewhere. Oh, we pinged the leg. Oh, you try it. And they were honored to die for the coordinator. No, they weren't. Oh, you're talking about the enemy? Yes, absolutely. They totally died for the coordinator. Now let's go into dismount. We're going to drop off our guys. Here comes Amiel in the most powerful standard battle armor the Inner Sphere has ever seen. And we're going to go in and swarm on this guy because Amiel, they didn't say this before, but Amiel was a total pro surfer back where he came from. And now he's surfing that incredible evasion. Yeah, he's... He's an adrenaline monkey. That's all I gotta say. Amuel, he's just gonna stay. He doesn't even care. Oh, serve cold? Oh, yes. Yes, absolutely. Can we... Can I actually go back? I can shift with this, right? Oh, we can. That's awesome. Look at this. Six evasion by going away and coming on back. I think. Oh, hello. Oh, my gosh. This is a very complicated path that we're taking. Take a look at this. This is like... Have you ever been... Did you ever go to Computer Lab with the Apple IIe's? and they made you program. <laughs> the bunny said it was fast. No one said it was not diabolical. Have you ever done computer lab and you had to give the this little like carrot mouse instructions on what direction to, to head in? You know what, let's kill this guy. All right, ping right to the middle. He's got 12 still. The Savannah should always get the green. The problem with the Savannah Master is even a Hornet might stomp it to death in one go. Halt. No, we don't want to halt the swarm attack. We're going to stay right here. Come on, ping this guy. Stick good. with it. Stick with it. Oh, 
Oh, oh, I saw some damage on the left side. I'm never sure what Amiel's actually doing in there. I'm sure he's, I don't know, making some shaved ice or something. You will kill him with a splash. Oh, yes. Hey, no drunk driving here. No, sir. <laughs> Do not arty near the master. Okay, got it, got it. I hear you. I hear you. Well, gosh, that's a bit of a problem, isn't it? We don't have many targets for our arty. What are we supposed to do? Oh, they dropped him off. Oh, oh my. Oh, I thought he was going to DFA. They're looping around back. <laughs> that was so bad. Wow. Wow. He must be so embarrassed. Oh my God. Wow. Oh, I, wow. You know, I should be kind to him and just put him out of his misery. That was so sad. So, so sad. There we go. There it is. Okay, we'll just pop off your PPC. Okay, good. Maybe, are you going to give us the mech? Maybe we'll get a mech? Oh, wouldn't that be great if we had a Hornet? Yutake, here we come. I mean, he's driving a Hornet. Embarrassment comes with the territory. Yes! Wow, it's taking us a long time to kill this thing. It's pretty tanky. <laughs> well, come on, Yutake. Not to be confused with the Yutake mushroom. And send it. Oh! Heck yes! All right! I think this is getting off to a sweltering start. All right! The story of how the Savannah Master got its name is interesting. Why? Because it crossed the Savannah in style? Bring it around. We're going to try and connect 20. It's a little difficult, but we'll try it. Battle Lord. And shot. Oh, yeah, that was close enough. Close enough. The front's a little bit weak, Dex. Yes, there can only be one of these guys around. Oh, man, that's difficult to hit. But try it. Battle Lord. Shot. Oh, oh, 15. All right. I haven't heard the words Hornet and Tanky in one sentence for a very long... Wait, who said it first? I feel cheated. I feel cheated right now. All right, coming on in. Here we go. We're going to swarm and absolutely overwhelm this scorpion. There's no way he's going to be able to get by us. All right, we pinged him one. Oh, oh, he's, we, we missed. Oh, wait, we hit we hit the wrong part. That's okay. We're mounted. We're moving. Okay, we're going to hold right here. No problem. Holding. At least not without hysterical laughter to follow. <laughs> oh, oh, that's dangerous. Anything is dangerous right now. Oh, we still have 90 armor. We're in double-digit territory, baby. Amul, hold, hold, hold. Let's see where this guy wants to go. Hopefully he can't. I don't think they can ram us. I was never able to ram anyone in a V, so I think we're okay. And all he has is a tag, right? Well, here we go. We got the scimitar. Or better yet, what do we come around from the backside? Oh, oh, this is too much firepower for this tiny little scorpion. Heck yeah, all right. Everything is going our way. No bunnies have been injured. And in fact, now the enemy only has a tag. I laugh at their chances. This is amazing. All right. I bet the bunnies are so impressed right now. <laughs> Inner sphere, hold. We've got our other Yutake. Bring around. There it is. And shot. Oh, uh, hey, at least we hit him. He's got 10 armor on the left. Yeah. No, when it was being shown to military purchasers. Oh, hold up. Ballista. Is anyone close? There's no danger close here, right? Yeah, this is totally fine. Shot. Firing on target. Heck Down. yes! Wow! Incredible first mission. All right. High five. <laughs> A milk run. Just as we expected. Good work, bunnies. Wow, I think we did very, very well. Total win, total win. Will the bunny league suffer a pilot loss? That is a resounding no. Congratulations to those who went to faith. And here we go. Medium laces. L laces? Medium lasers pulse. A beagle active probe. I will take that. We'll take the hornet part. Or, or better yet. Yeah, we'll take the we'll take the hornet part. Do I want the hornet part? No, no, we don't. All right, we're going to grab the pulse. All right, here we go. Actually, we'll grab tag. All right, three, <laughs> two, and one. Oh, we got, oh, we have everything. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to sell these medium lasers. We need all the cash right now. Perfect. And the core can go. And, oh, I like half tons. Well, let's stop over by the store. I kind of feel like maybe we want to swap something out. We've got a wheeled APC. This at least comes with an SRM too. We've got a vedette. 
I wouldn't mind another vedette. That's pretty good. And what's with the Armstrong battle armor? The result. The Armstrong was the result of the periphery attempting to get into the battle armor market. Without any sample suits, they started from first principles and began with armored spacesuits. They did not get far. I think we'll pass on this one. I think we'll... <laughs> oh, Jesus. You know what? Let's go over to the galleon. What do they have? Two small lasers. It's very, very fast, actually. My goodness. I think the Vedette might be a nice pickup for us, quite frankly. Uh, let's just take a look at what we have currently in the V-Bay. The Savannah Master. How fast is this, actually? It's 5.8. Really? It seems faster than 5.8. Seems like very fast, if you ask me. This is 2.5. The Yutake can move very fast, and that's considered 1. But I guess flying is a little different, yeah? Storage for when we have a mech worth the name. Yes, yes. Storage is everything out here. I guess we can replace the Savannah Master as much as I like it. It's so impressive. I really, really dig it. Uh, we'll go in and uh, maybe sell that. Curious how much is it going to get for us. Maybe it'll get us a cool... 37... Th well, that's more than I thought we'd get for it. That's amazing. And the Allsvin. I guess we will pull down the... Like, we can sell the Wasp, which is great. We can actually sell the Cicada. I forgot about that. And look, we're back up above 2 million. That's amazing. On tabletop, the Savannah Master has a speed of 13. To oh my god. 20? 20. That's ridiculous. So it suggested the Savannah Master test trial might have been rigged according to Sarna. Lewis sold 1,000 units to the LCAF. Well... I mean, who vetted? I guess shame on the LCAF for not vetting their purchase. But I mean, it's so cool. It kind of reminds me of a tugboat, Todd. We'll get the vedette. Not that I've ever been around a tugboat. I just want to make that clear. All right. So we got ourselves a vedette replacement. That's amazing. Uh, let's take a look. So 35s. We got 50s. We could actually replace them all with vedettes if we wanted. But the scimitar. The scimitar moves at 8. This moves at 6. And you can get an AC5 on target immediately, right? That's pretty compelling. And then as far as the Yutake goes, I don't know why I bought two. I got a little trigger happy. Let's be real. Yeah. Not really. The LCAF is filled with social generals. I thought that was Steiner. Was that Steiner? Am I wrong here? So Amiel, get that piloting up there. Gotta love it. You gotta run with the best of them. Up we go. I can totally believe one industrialist pulling the wool over their eyes. Well, you know, if you've got a small head, it doesn't take much to pull the wool over your eyes. That's what I always say. Serve cold. I don't. I honestly don't know what that means. Got a bit of an armor upgrade. Darn straight. Heck yes, we all got an armor upgrade. In fact, in fact, once we go into battle again, the nice thing is there are no repair costs. So this is all pocketed. That's kind of insane to me. We don't usually see that kind of generosity in the Bunny League. Battle on the Highlands. Let's do it. We're fighting against the Magistracy of Canopus once again. It seems like they can't get enough of the Bunny League. Two pick 11. This time around, we're going to go ahead and bring ourselves that vedette. We absolutely love it. Serve Cold gets a bit of an upgrade. Heck yes. He proved himself quite valiantly. And Amiel back on in. And this time we're going to shift click. That's right. We remembered... And you can ride with HP this time. We got to keep it kind of varied so that the bunny, the bunny enemies out there don't really know who to attack. Okay, what do we got? We've got them, bunnies. Right out in the open. These guys are amateurs. Get eyes on them and take them out. Good hunting, bunnies. Olivera out. I think the biggest problem that we have right now is the water, if I'm perfectly honest, because all of us are submerged. Look at this. I hope the bunnies have hermetically sealed drive. Oh my god, we really cannot move very far, can we? Well, let's go back to land. The hover tank can, though. I love it. Makes sense. The scimitar also can. The Yutake obviously can. The U oh, oh, I forgot. A lot of us are flying, heck yes. And the vedette is the only one that is slowed. Okay, that's fine. She lost to a five-ton hover medium laser. Hey, that's pretty darn cool. If I mean, not that she lost. I just mean the hover medium laser. It's hovering. That's so cool. It's like out of Back to the Future at this point, right? Well, I guess we should probably wait we'll for our buddies to join us, right? Scimitar to the four. We've got enemy contact already. Wow, okay. I crossed... We crossed the channel a little faster than I expected. That's cool. And hold. Wait. These are quite nimble vehicles. I dig it. All right, who do they have? Unknown. Unknown. Let's start with the slowest of the group. Let's get served out there. He's ready to support. 
Hey there, Kung Fu. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Did I go from speed racer to slow poke? No, the only reason why you're a little bit slower is just... Oh, they've... Oh, crap. They've got a... What is a sprayer? Uh-oh. They tagged. They tagged, sir. What is this? A sprayer. Two sprayers, a small binary laser, and a periphery tag. Oh, you've been periphery tagged. I don't know what that is, but that sounds... Order. Scary. We've got Commander? five evasion here. Hey. Let's get HP out there. On the move as quickly as possible here. We got the green. I got the and we're actually going to lock this guy. So actually, who do they have out here? They have a commando with, oh my God, lasers. With all the things. That is terrifying. Holy crap. That's terrifying. Some kind of pump. Yep. Acid, oil, fluid guns. It's been suggested the fight was staged because the LCAF standard operating procedure says no ammunition for demonstrations. She should not have access to actual machine gun ammo. Well, maybe people didn't like the other guy, right? I'm impressed these tanks are sealed up well enough to cross underwater. Well, you know, if they did it in Oregon Trail, they cocked the wagons and forded the river. I mean, you'd think that we can... Oh, yes, Commander. they were pretty advanced back then. They were pretty advanced. Well, who can we shoot safely? I guess we should probably start shooting now before we get any closer 23 or 31 hopefully we're not too close to the bunnies oh that's oh that went a little wide that's okay that's fine this is fine we're flying no worries now we can actually safely drop off amuel right here's amuel he's right oh actually before we do that our bunnies their gunnery isn't very high yet we should probably shoot first <laughs> we should probably shoot first we got our hover tank beautiful ppcs shoot farther away oh boy this is gonna t okay this one might take a while this might take a little bit no. scimitar shift over can we get cover yes we can ac fives from across the way gotta love it 27 shot right. yeah we hit him all right he actually played the new version of oregon trail on steam deck i did oh man i wish i would love to have a steam deck that commando could be a remarkable salvage opportunity. It's very, very terrifying. I mean, it's quite terrifying, if I'm perfectly yeah, honest. Oh, that's looking good. We got a breach, bunnies. We got a breach. Gotta love it. Oh, my goodness. Let's dismount. We are ready to go. We're actually going to double turn this guy and turn him into Swiss cheese. It's going to be amazing. So we're coming on over into the blue. We've got the shots. There's orange. There's the yes. Heck yes. Splash one for Amuel. Heck yes. What a beast. All right. No, I did. Brings me back. Oh, <laughs> high five, sir. That's awesome. Well, you know, it's time to bug it out of here. That was an amazing assault by the Bunny League, I must say. Load up, Amuel man. Heck yes. No need for the battle claws. Yeah, not even. Why would we worry about battle claws when we can just shoot our tiny little battle armor sized small it wow what's a small laser for battle armor like a laser pointer or something will we be honoring this start by reserving at least four land spots all the time for v's as a house rule uh no no we will not one of the goals of this campaign oh no <laughs> oh, that's not good that's got hamiel in it one of the goals of the campaign is to field as many mechs as possible it doesn't mean we won't have these but i would like the ability to field 12 mechs at the same time battle armor will have the four slots though because you can only really have the battle armor for it yeah well let's start with hb now that he's gone here we go up gun laser rifle you've died from dysentery i mean with this kind of start you never know it might happen he's not going I would, Anywhere. though, like to get our Yutake away and flip a Yui, or at least flip to the side. There it is. Eight evasion at speed. Oh, and wow. now we can actually shoot. I won't say confidently, but our, our sniper artillery. Please don't hit the other bunnies. Okay, perfect, perfect. Great, great. I'm pretty sure I always started Oregon Trail with dysentery oh my what start did you choose you didn't choose the banker did you i mean everyone chose the banker in my class <laughs> we all wanted the monies we wanted to buy things at the shop that's the first time i bought stuff at the shop let's be real all right and we landed that's beautiful this guy's busted on this side so here we go coming in from the damaged side and battle lord and send it i forgot about the ppc being too close come on 
Maybe he'll get scared and punch out. Hold, hold, hold. Please don't come at us. Oh, he's turning. Oh my God, that is a lot of lasers. I really want this thing. <laughs> I really want this thing. This is, that thing's okay. I'm okay with this. Okay, down to one. He's already made his move. Let's get Dex out of there. Bring him around. Flip it. Flip the Yui. I'm reporting for duty. Heck yes, crossbow. Thank you so much. Oh, a shot to the head. He's not bleeding out, though. Oh, should I use sniper artillery? That might be a bit much. We should probably be gentle. We're not going to hit him directly, though. Yeah, we didn't. Oh, okay. See, that was fine. We just shaved a little arm off or something. He is panicking after all. Scimitar. HB is rather gentle. He has just small lasers. Here we go. Shot to the butt. HB sees the green. He can't resist. He's already panicking. I wouldn't stick around. Let's get Omega in there. Here we go. Is it viable even endgame to field support vehicles like Long Tom? Oh, that was not... Gosh darn it, Omega. Define gentle, please. Oh, it's fine. Like Long Toms and Ella... Oh, yeah, absolutely. Are you kidding me? Long Toms? Good through the whole game, baby? That, that's great. A milk run, just as we expected. Good work, bunnies. All right, bunnies. Total win, total win. That's what we like to hear. All right, so, so far we've had two successes very fast in succession. Haven't even had to do anything as far as rebalance armor or anything like that. I kind of feel like this is the fastest in it campaign we've ever run. So let's go in and bring this over. Let's see what we got. Commando three of it. Oh, that's so good. Okay, here we go. Three, two, and one. All right. I guess we got three out of four of both the commando feet. Wait, but why is it FT? Oh, okay, whatever. And the stinger, five PA. Why? Wait, why FT? This I have to know. Fresh from your friends at Periphery Arms Incorporated comes this commando, affectionately named the Frozen Tempest. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. I like that a lot better than feet. Based on the blazing inferno, the Frozen Tempest uses a battery of chemical lasers for firepower, while the prototype XL engine keeps it all running. Where the blazing inferno used standard lasers and was famous for overheating in the thick of combat. The... well, that... Not a very good reputation. The Frozen Tempest chemical lasers run as cool as a glass of ice water in the Arctic. Oh, my. wow. I like this sales pitch. I really want this thing now. Let's take a look. I don't think we have any repairs. This is probably the coolest part of this entire run thus far. There's like barely any cost to keep this crew going. It's amazing. All right, stop over at the barracks. We got some points to apply, I'm sure. Amul up to the big three. Gotta love it. Debts. Done. Omega. I guess Omega can get a little bit of gunnery. He needs the help. He was supposed to be gentle. He wasn't as gentle as I would have liked. There we go. Actually, to be fair, HB was the one that blasted the arm, but you know, stuff happens. All right, we're good. And everyone is all set. That's perfect. Let's go over to the command center. We're making some fast, fast progress. Battle Polar. What if we boost it up a little bit? Escort, battle, battle. Oh, I guess there isn't one. I guess we'll do the battle in a polar biome and then move on after this. That seems pretty fair, yeah? All right, here we go. 211 once again, this time against the Torian Concordate. Hissing off everybody that matters. This is great. Here, <laughs> Jeez. All right, well, will the Bunny League suffer a pilot loss? Five minutes on the clock, and we will see what you got. We got a half skull difficulty battle in a polar biome, and we have an all V start, yeah? We've got them, bunnies, right out in the open. These guys are amateurs, again, and they're so far away. Get eyes on them and take them out. HB, I fought alongside you years ago. It's an honor to do the same today. Wait, we have allies? Oh, what is this? The Hell's Heart Regiment, Pride of the Concordant, the Torian Guard, stands ready to defeat you. Fight with dignity, if you can. That guy's a wrestler? I am so confused right now. So we have an ally, apparently, and we also have a wrestler out there. This is so strange. Standing by. And I forget, did we preload already? You. No, we did not. Okay. There, there. <laughs> Let's get Wait, HB over there. We got to go pick copy? up our pal. Is this smart? Paradox is the company 
Oh, hang on one sec. Let's get Amiel in here. We want to mount on up and be ready for it. There we go. And hold. Roger. What is the way down? I think we have to go to the left, right? Confirmed. Left, right. Uh, we got our other vedette. Oh my gosh, it is so fast. And the Yutake. Beautiful. Uh, how do I get down with a hover tank? I guess I can come down this way. Affirmative. Ballista. I mean, the ballista, even the ballista is going to have to move because we are far, far away. Interesting, this gun could get down, I guess, because it has wheels, maybe. Advancing. Yutake forward. And there we go. And our vedette. Oh my god, the vedette is so good in this terrain. It's crazy. Paradox only has the license and code for the existing Battletech game. Nothing more. The Unsvins got a big nerf. See, I never tried the Unsvins. Oh, 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 there we go. Our ally's a falcon with a busted leg. I mean, it has really nice stuff. Oh, and we also have a... a fi oh my god. What? This is from the local government? Can we... Really? So... I think we need we need to make a stop. Let's uh <laughs> can we Friendly Fire is on. I know I know we joke about this all the time about being in a friendly fire and then loot your allies, but Awaiting never order. before have I really wanted to do that other than now. Okay, we got our hover tank. I'm not too sure if we have to come out this way or otherwise come down with the careful maneuvers, yeah? Do we go like so? Confirm. Small, small moves? Does that work? Oh, never mind. Let's see, we got HP. I guess we'll move forward with who we can. So off we go. We actually have sight now. That's interesting. Hold. And then we've got Omega on the move. There we go. All right, so we need to figure out how to get off of this hill. That's the big thing right here. So careful maneuvers for Ronin. And then it moves us forward. Surf Cold's in the Vedette, so Surf Cold's fine. So he's there. We careful maneuvers for pretty much everybody. Death's already has careful maneuver, and there we go. Now we can do one at a time. Oh, boy. Copy that. And one. And one. There. And Amiel, okay. hold. Maybe Amiel's just going to win it for us all by himself, yeah? We've got Dud to careful maneuver again. And Ronin. Oh, we're almost down the hill. This is perfect time to do this when we're not in enemy contact yet. Forward. Moving out. And HB, who's going to probably overextend if we're not too careful. Actually, where is that lance? It's on the other side of the giant mountain. Oh my god. I'm they on do this way. on purpose. They want to separate the bunnies from each other. It's the only way that they shall win. And only HB would be silly enough to fall for such a thing, but even HB knows that this is a trap. We need the side slip skill for these kind of terrain badly. It's just too good to pass. Yes, you are correct. Well, we do have two dedicated V pilots who would be fancy Dan in the hovercraft. Yeah. Oh, hello. Okay. So our allies are on the way. We are about oh, to have contact. So me. I'd really like to get these guys on open ground, but they're not quite there yet. Oh, and the Falcon's still back here. The Falcon doesn't even know how to get off this hill. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's still over here. While the Firestarter's already down in Timbuktu. Commander. My goodness. And look, the Firestarter's down already. Oh, he's just trying to give us moral support. That's what he came back for us. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, oh, we've been spotted. They got shots on Omega. And no joy. They can't connect with us. Love it. I tend to try to turn a Banshee into a machine gun melee machine for late game six support hard points. Well, that is why we want the Juggernaut, let me tell you. We really want that Juggernaut because it has 20 support hard points. So I'm super excited about it and they come mostly with MGs. Alright, what do we got? Looks like we've got two out here. We have a Stinger with an ER medium laser. Looks like they already shot off 30 rockets and then a single laser on a Galleon. Wow, that's a lot of work for such a small... Oh, that's okay. Here we go. Lock out that stinger. Ready for we got the Omega inbound. Hopefully we can get shots on. We have the small lasers. Oh, nope. They got more. They got more. They've got a, at least one V back there. Connect right on the side. Oh, 12. Gosh, we just have all V tolls at this point. Vedette. Oh, even the, though the Vedette is fast, it's still lacking, lagging behind. Hold, hold, hold. 
and hold here. All right, beautiful. So they have... Okay, so they've got four. Where are the four? That's the question. One, two, three... Oh, right underneath us. A J. Edgar with an AoE flamer and a medium laser. Oh, my. Well, Amiel can take care of that guy, right? I mean, he's not worried. I'm not worried if he's not worried. Let's reserve. Roger that. Oh, he hit us. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> eh, it's fine. That's Omega. Nobody cares about Omega. Let's hold again. I don't think they'll connect with us twice, right? We're too fast. Oh, and he whiffed it, I guess. I'm never worried. See? Gotta love it. Amuel, you're with me anyway. Okay, let's hold again. I'd rather they completely utilize their turns. What else do they have? I'm kind of nervous about this V. What is it? Not the Galleon. Oh, and he whiffs it. But what about the other guy? This one back here. He's such an unknown right now. What is he? He might be devastating, you know? Maybe it's like a long tom cannon or something. Well, let's see. We've got our... Oh, our scimitar way back here. It cannot move yet. Okay, well, let's go reserve all the way down to one. Ballista. Oh, we can connect. We can take the shot, bunnies. That's what we're talking about. All right, here we go. The ballista has range made from the gods. We can shoot at the J. Edgar, which is right next to our Utake. Let's not do that. Okay, perfect. Cool. Can we salvage vehicles aye, aye. that we scrap? Uh, not unless you're super gentle. You have to be really gentle with vehicles. They're a little fragile. Carefully maneuver. Oh, I think we're finally out of the ditch for real this time. Here we go. HB's ready. Actually, I kind of want to see what is this guy? This is the fourth of the Lance, a Pegasus with SRM-12. Okay, that has to go. That needs to go. Pronto. Let's shoot that guy. We didn't really ping him. All right, let's get Amuel out of there. Dismount time. Finally time to dismount. Here we go. We'll close in, take the shot, and on the next one, swarm on in, yeah? We need that thing gone. Here we go. Brute force, bunnies. Brute force. Yeah, that, that's not much force. But you know what? It is brutish to the max. All right, we're moving. We're moving. Let's get out of here. Skedaddle time. We need to pull. You know what? We're going to move as one. We're going to attack that same guy. And this way, we can actually land sniper artillery shots without worrying about hurting the bunnies. We're always thinking about the bunnies. I hear you. Serve cold in the vedette. Almost there. <laughs> I've heard of a milk run. I think Samir was just trying to invent a ditch run in this one. Well, trench warfare was a thing that she was interested back in the day. This moves on 10. Crap. I better mount up now, huh? Oh, that's eight. Never mind. Hold. Reserve. They get two movements, one of which is the AOE flamer. Hold on eight. So SRM 12 is available now, but they choose the stinger... Oh, they hit us. Oh, they hit Amiel. Amiel's fine. He's still fine, bunnies. I have good news. He's still alive. Okay, Amiel, now's the time. Mount up, buddy. Mount up. Swarm. Swarm. Like you've never swarmed before. Oh, wait. Who did we swarm? We swarmed the right target, didn't we? I think. Did we? Oh, thank God. For some reason, I thought we might have swarmed our own... <laughs> Oh, that's our ally. Who's up next? Wow, this is such a crap show. I don't know. <laughs> Enemy flanking. All right, so here's the SRM-12 with Amiel hanging on for dear life. Oh, he's not going, really? All right, hold. When's he gonna do anything? Oh, Amiel's still hanging on. Oh, no. Oh, we're fine. Heck yes, aid evasion protects us once again. Welcome back, Dets. So far, everybody's still alive. This guy's got four evasion and Amiel's there. So reserve, reserve. We've got Dud. We're ready. Uh, where can we go? Oh, we're, we're not close enough anymore. Oh, my God. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Uh, Dets. Oh, Dets is still on the mountain. Oh, my. Jeez, Louise. All right, there we go. There we go. He, I think he's off the mountain now. We got Ronin, who is... Oh, Really? He's in a tree. All right, I guess we're we're not off the mountain yet. We're coming out of that ditch one day. 
One day we'll get there. So, uh, what faction start would you guys recommend for a completely new Battletech Advanced player? Steiner. Although, if you're completely new, there's always the medium start. I think I think it's called the medium start, like MC2, like Mech Commander. That that's crazy. That's really really good. Off we go. HP and let's go in and lock him down to two. Brand new tank start run. That's us. Yes. You talk a. Um, I mean, at this point, I feel like we should follow the breach on the stinger. He's facing us right now, so we want to come in from his from this side right here, I believe. So we want to see that blue. There we go. We want this blue right here. That's where the breach is, and we're going to try and connect right on the torso. Unless we completely miss, but he does have some evasion. I like the clan start, but elementals are BS. Well, I mean, you can also take the clan start and then travel somewhere else with your money, huh? Shot on, no. Hold, hold. We don't want to shoot at Amiel. I really got to run a Battletech tabletop RPG. Heck yes, guy again. Inner Sphere. Okay. Do we hold? Let's hold. Hold. Come on, Amiel. 28. 28 on the left side. Shots. Eight. He's got eight on the left. It's happening slowly but surely. There's that stinger getting out of here. And he whiffs it. I want that sweet clan technology. Well, you can kind of balance the two. Hey. We've actually seen clanner tech oh, in really you weird places. So there's there's many places you can go for it. Ah, uh, let's see. We want... I'd like to get over and get the blue on this side. So here we are. But we don't have that angle. There it is. There it is. There it is. Perfect. This is what we like to see. And this might pop that stinger and shot. Oh, oh not yeah. quite. We hit the arm and the leg of all things. Yeah. It's mostly M-A-S-C fire moths. Let's see. Go Omega. We want the blue. We want the blue. On my way, double time. And shot. Oh, I see orange. And a ping to the head. Not bad. Not bad. We are being very gentle with this stinger. It's mostly MASC fire moths and hover tanks with them on it. Bombing in from outside vision in your backline. Oh, that sounds like our style. As long as it's us doing it and not the enemy to us, yeah? Hold. And scimitar. Let's go down to one. That means our allies can go. Falcon is... The Falcon's just going to be chugging along. I, I don't know if having allies in this case necessarily helps us too much. That ballista. Yeah, the ballista. Yeah, the ballista's out of range too. That start, I concentrate on picking up equipment and what You know what? I'm just gonna... We're just gonna sit these ones out. Oh, okay. This one can move. Deaths, you're just gonna chill for the rest of the fight. Here we go. And we got our vedette. Ooh, are we finally almost... We almost have a shot. I mean, I guess we should probably stay high, right? So up we go. We'll be a little close for an AC5, but that's fine. All right, hold. We only have eight left on that left. Amiel did a great job. We want to hit that left side again. Good connect. And it is on... I have no idea which side. And then guns. Oh, and that's on the right side. Okay, so I don't know what the right side's at now. Oh, where's he going? And a whiff. Okay, this this is fine. The Yutakis can handle this a little bit at a time. We don't even need all the other bunnies on this one. Down the one. Let's see what they do. Eight. Oh, wow. They're counter-reserving with the SRM-12 as well. Interesting. I wonder why. They don't have anything that will close the distance with them. Maybe they're hoping that we'll drop evasion. Singleton from the Galleon. No joy. I think we might drop off the swarm on the next one. And no joy. All right. Not too bad. Remember to put torso cockpits on the two Cs to work the quirk away. The two Cs specifically. That makes sense because they're not the Omnimex, yeah? Oh, we can get the ballista. All right. Hang tight. Hang tight. Wait, why am I in a Let's try and pop the stinger first. Okay, so we're going to go in with Omega. We want to get the blue. Bring her around. There it is. We'll use precise strike and send it. There it is. There it is. And the stinger is down. Beautiful. As we're talking about. And down he goes. 
And now he's bleeding out, so we can actually let him be. We don't even have to engage that guy. So what I would like to do is back off the line, but then lock up another target. Bring them down to zero if possible, because they're basically shooting across the map. But it looks like they really don't have any evasion at all. We'll lock up the Jaeger Flamer. He's not going anywhere. I, I want all of his small clan pulses. Go. Dear God, that's amazing. All right, we're going to motor forward. No the Bunny Motor Club is ready to send it 47% chance. Firing at enemy. Oh, yeah, that went way off. But we hit something. I Hopefully, it's not a bunny. Yes, I don't think I heard HB's voice or anything. Hey. Yeah. Okay. Oh, man. Hold, hold, hold. Keeping it cool. And served in the vedette. Okay, perfect. Oh, wait, did serve get hit? Oh, no, serve didn't get hit. The J. Edgar got hit. Okay, thank God. I was like, serve cold's over there, too. Oh, crap. All right, bring her around, bring her around. Super close for the rear, though. Can we get up higher? That's nice. Okay, that's a lot better. Love that. And we can even push them back on the turn order. Right, Commander. Full value, 37. Okay, great. This is fantastic. On, Smoked salted almonds. Oh, I love roasted salted like anything. All right, halt the swarm attack. So we're dismounting. We want to get off this thing. It's facing forward, so we want to come over to this side right here. We've got the shot and full send. One! We've got... <laughs> There's one structure left, bunnies. There's one structure left. The Bunny League curse for sure. Oh, man. Amuel, you're doing a really good job. Oh, I, wait. Did he hit his own guy? I think he hit his own guy. All right. That guy's on our side. That's amazing. Scimitar, hold. If you're out there, just hang tight. Even our allies should just hang tight. And, all right, so the Flamer's turning around, trying to hit Serve Cold. Staying up there is actually working in our favor. Oh, man. You Yutake. Okay, so I think we can actually drop this guy right now if we can get far enough in. We want the blue. Oh, we're not fast enough. I guess we'll come from this side. I got the speed you need. Shot pushing back to six. Yeah, that's that's the other side. That's the other side. He's down. He's down. Panic level critical. This is it. We can actually get the blue with this guy. Bring around. Roger. Shot. There. <laughs> that took a little bit. That took a little bit, but it was worth it. Three salvageable parts. I will definitely take that. Heck yes. Standing by. And what are we? Ballista? Ballista's out there. We've got more possibilities. 34 onto Galleon. Oh, and from downtown, splash right in with that high explosive shell from the sniper artillery from across the map, and we scored. So that just leaves one. There's just this one right here. We can keep Sir Cold right at the backside with that AC-5 and keep shooting, not letting him get away. He's got 14 here. It's pretty much done at this point. Let's go ahead and mount up to whomever is available. Our Yutankes can finish the job pretty easily, I would imagine. Singleton, medium laser are on the field. I heal. Scimitar, hold. HB. Okay, okay. We want the rear. Oh, oh, I saw the green. If we're right on top of him, interesting. Okay, I don't know how that works. I got the can we shoot down? Huh. I don't know if this is going to work. Yeah, we're like on the occupying the same. That's that's not good, is it? Are we going to hit our own? Hey. <laughs> I didn't know that was possible. I really hate when they counter reserve when they have spawn protection. Oh, yes. I would like them to spend their spawn protection as soon as possible, please. You want and hold. I can give you okay, served. We're looking for that green. There's the green. Received. And shot. Roger that. 14 
He's got 29 between armor and structure at the rear. I really don't want to shoot with the ballista, so hold for dead. And now Amiel can dismount. Oh, are we going to dismount right on top of this guy? Oh, this is interesting. How does this work? Oh, wow. I think we're close enough to swarm. Uh, let's pull back. Here we go. And shot. 14. Oh, we hit the sides. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, boy. Here it comes. Oh, flamers. Oh, no. Ooh. Uh, Amiel is okay. He still has three other lives. It's okay. So Amiel might be out for a little bit. We really don't even have a med bay right now. I think we're even lacking on bandages. Let's be real. Oh yeah, we need that green. We need that green. I wish I could shift click move this. All right, I guess we'll come back here and hold. And then on Omega, need equipment replacement. Here we go. This might do it right here. And shot. There it is. Oh my gosh. Wow. Woo. New career. Anything interesting happening with it? Hey, Thelenius. Welcome. Well, currently, it's a Melkrun. A Melkrun. Just as we expected. Good work, buddies. All right, bunnies, total win, total win. Will the bunny league suffer a pilot loss? That is a resounding no. Congratulations to those who had the faith. Here's the thing. Now that we finished that one, we will actually have time for Amiel to actually cool off, get armored up again, because we now are going to travel to a new location, yeah? So ER medium, that sounds nice to have. Ooh, SRM, ooh, ferrofibrous. That's what I like to see. So ER mediums, SRMs, AOE flamer. Here we go. Three, two, and one. We've got three out of four of a Pegasus if we sh so choose it. AOE flamers. Let's go ahead and sell that off. Rocket launchers are nice. SRMs are nice. Core ammo. Great. Okay, so we have a few repairs to do, but you know, we got the time. Let's go ahead and stop by the mech bay. We'll go over to our one and only battle armor right here. We got to do a little bit of a refit right in the middle just a small battle armor small laser we got the replacement perfect that's what i like to see battle armor support ppc is 0.3 the small laser is 0.2 okay unfortunate would have liked to have another one and i think we only have the one slot although this has two and i think there are some that are oh look at that oh the machine gun weighs something i know there's battle armor submachine gun and i think that weighs zero so you can cram in as many as you have slots yeah I'm sorry, 12 mechs? That sounds heavy. Well, we like heavy. We like heavy, yeah? Okay, let's see what we can do. We're all kitted up there. The Locust, our only bunny intern. And now we need to get ready to head on out. Where are we going to go? We do want to head over to Davian Territory so that we can work our relationships there. There's also Merchant's Rest. Actually, that's, we're really close by, aren't we? Oh, yeah, we are close by. Oh, cool. <laughs> Oh, mm, we definitely don't have enough money for this. So I, I will save that for later, bunnies. Don't worry. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. We're going to head over to... I think Half Skull's perfect for this loadout right now. So let's take a look. Half Skull, Federated Sons. It's a water world. Interesting. But this one is going to be the cheapest. So let's head out over here. We'll go to Lindsay. That sounds familiar for some reason. I don't quite recall. Was that in the campaign? Was Lindsay available in the campaign? It's now. close enough to the Oregon Reach, so I would think it is. Is that where one of the main missions is? Huh. Well, we're headed out. Amiel's going to be back before you know it. In fact, only <laughs> he's going to make it right before. That's amazing. What we should do, though, is head over to the Engineering Bay. I totally forgot. We do need to get some upgrades, so I would like to do the power systems. Right now, repairing mechs isn't really important. So we want to get the infrastructure in place so we can get further upgrades, new slots, things like that. Yeah. All right. We are finally here at Lindsay. We are now in Federated Sun territory. So we can start working that rep. Armstrong, Achilles. So the Achilles is a little bit heavier. It has limited ammunition, but it definitely has quite a punch. That's awesome. Chaparral. 
Why? That seems like a bit of an upgrade. Heck yes. I love it. Should we just have all chaparrales? No, okay. That's a little ridiculous. Let's see. What else is here? King David Gauss rifles. Ooh, yes. Oh, that is an upgrade. Okay. Calm your horses, HB. Calm your horses. Reloading rocket launcher, small Paul silver bullet Gauss. Foot scissors, hardened life support. Oh, wow. I, I rarely see these. I'm just going to buy that. Okay, oh, cool. <laughs> eh, magnification array, mortar fire control system. Ooh, tactic support? Really? I barely ever see that. Okay, we're, we're getting a little low on funds. Range finders. Love them. Not going to buy it, though. I shall resist. Oh, long tom ammo already? Inferno? Oh, my God. Maybe we should get that. UX, SRMs. Okay, cool. Well, now let's go in and take a look at the command center. Chaparral, me want. We definitely need to get a replacement here. What would we replace even? Training day at height. Wouldn't that be funny if we go into training day with a chaparral? Hang on. Wait, we're let's make a stop. We're making a stop at the mech bay bunnies. We got to see something here. So in our V bay, we have 55. We've got a hover tank with a PPC and an SRM4. We've got two AC5s right here. And we've got a couple of Yutakes, but we don't even have enough battle armor to fit inside of these. So the Scimitar moves at 8. The Vedette moves at 6, but it has more armor. And this guy is a PPC. I think the Scimitar, we could probably replace that one. Or maybe we'll drop the Yutake for now, and we'll just have the one, right? So let's put this down, and we can totally afford it, I think. Let's go and sell some things. We've got our Allsvin. This does have C3, which is cool and all, but I think we'll... We'll get rid of that. And now we've got our Utake. Oh, crap. We are a little bit low. We're a tiny bit low. You know what? That's okay. I'm sure there's something like the sprayer that we could sell. I'm sure there's something like these cores that we could sell. An engine Excel probably need that. Uh, I might have purchased all the hardened life support. <laughs> we'll get rid of the cryo fluid. There we go. All right. We've got enough. Oh, crap. This is bad. You know what? We're just going to do it before we regret this. All right, now we're almost broke. Okay, that's not good. Well, let's go ahead and take a look at what we can do. All right, here we go. Siem. I, I don't know if that's correct. Hello. At high noon, do a duel. No training day. Assassination, one skull. It, that might be a little bit much. If we do training day. Nah. Oh, wait, we need to get more bunny pilots too. Okay, we'll look at that later. Let's start with an assassination in the lowlands. How about that? That seems fine. Tortuga Dominions, let's go. Oh, we kind of need money, don't we? What if we go with... This is two. We'll go with this amount right there. 122. Close enough. All right, beautiful. Okay, so let's take a look at what we got. We've got our scimitar, our yutake. Everything is looking fine. We've got HB. We have our chaparral. This is fantastic. We'll toss that in. And of course, we have our inner sphere battle armor and Amiel is ready to go. All right. One skull difficulty assassination in the lowlands. We just bumped it up a half skull and we are perilously, perilously low on funds. Will the Bunny League suffer a pilot loss? Five minutes on the clock and we'll see what you got. Bunnies, this is the region we've been asked to patrol as part of the net. Our employers need us to keep an eye out for the propaganda agent, as this is one possible escape route she might take if she's in this region. We need to find her and take her out, and then we can evac. All right, you heard the guy. Oh, no. Oh, Death's Consort. Oh, great. Hey, Mercs, how about you today and we call this even? You don't need to be involved in this. I'd rather not have to kill you if I don't have to. So turn around and go home and we'll forget all about it. Yeah, sure thing. One high skill pilot in a light yep. doing nothing but sprint and lerm boys. Yes, all the missiles, hundreds of them. Well, the... Our target's way out there. So let's go ahead and load. We forgot to preload again. That's okay. So let's go reserve down to one. Gosh, they're so close, though. I feel like we should scout these guys out first. Oh, they're coming to scout us instead. Let's go home. Yeah, that's right. Hold, hold, hold. Oh, he fell? Who? Was it this guy? Target damaged. Concentrate your fire and bring it down. Wait, someone's on the ground? <laughs> All right, it's happening. Okay, we know what we need to do, bunnies. We know what we've got to do. All right, Omega in. Let's go in and pick up our package. Here we go. We got to get close enough here. Hold. We need to get Amiel. Everyone scramble, scramble, scramble. We detect distress. That's what the enemy commander's piloting competence is now in question. No, this is the perfect situation for us. That's what. 
We got Ronin in the scimitar. Oh, please tell me you're not stuck. I guess we cannot quote unquote sprint. So we're just going to make a regular move and hold. Order. Ballista. Hover tank. Oh, perfect. Hover tank. There we go. There we go. Hover tank. What do we got? I'm guessing it's this guy right here. Hold. Standing by. The dead. In the water. Love a failed opening pilot. Heck yes. It's the right thing. Get to cover. Are we close enough to lock? I don't think so. So let's go in and attack the ground right there. Time to light them up. Went a little wide, but I'll take it. At this point, that's probably relatively effective. And let's go in a lineup. We've got the shot. Attack the ground. Oh, that is so wide. I, copy. I don't even know what this is. <laughs> All I know is it's pinging red right now. It's pinging red. Who's on eight? Oh, he gets right back up. Okay, so he just stood up, probably. Hold. Hold again. Perfect. Now down to one. Then it's going to be our target out here in the giant spotlight in the middle of the water. I don't know how that happened. It's, it's, checks, it's damage, sir. Yeah. <laughs> I sure hope that's the case. Can we get up? Oh, we cannot. We have to go around. Really? Okay. How about this? Let's get Omega. Omega's flying. He's got the package, but he's got the sight. What do we got? What is it? It is a javelin with a bunch of rockets. Oh, dear God. And we've got a Shadowhawk with a howitzer. Oh, my gosh. This is quite promising. Hold here. What's up, boss? Starting with the Ballista. I mean, we could definitely... I definitely want to get rid of the howitzer. That's terrifying. Shot. Affirmative. And HB. Oh, man. You Shot out. Heck yes! Our first direct connect there. Rocket launcher 70. Yeah, it's a lot. Artillery is one of my favorite weapon types. It really is very, very, very cool. Definitely a game changer for sure. Good all the way till the end. Oh, hello. We've got potentially maybe a V out here. Scimitar on the move. Just keep tucking in. And the vedette. Oh, I don't want to get too caught out. We'll try and hug the walls. Limit the line of sight. He barely moves. All oh, the rocket launchers, 40 of them right at Ronin. That's a lot of connections. 79. No way that only did that much damage. He's still fine. He still has three quarters of his armor in the front there. Almost. <laughs> Holy crap. VTOL. Yeah, no, it's, it's kind of what we've got to work with right now. Can we get... Yeah, okay. We'll get over to the backside here. Let's go ahead and open that up if possible. Omega has enough. Come on, open that up. Eight evasion versus rocket launcher 70. Interesting results. He only has six, and he's got the high ground as well, which is a little bit rough. All right, we're going to hold still. I want to wait. So he gets to move on six. That's the next one. Ugh, I guess we better go. Amiel, get out. Here we go. Swarm up, Amiel. Swarm up. Get on this guy. Are we close enough? Yes, we are 97%. And he's in. Ping to the leg. And guns. Shot to middle. Center torso at 106 out of 170. Okay, we'll take it. We'll take it. Hold. Oh, he, he reserved? Did he, did he stop? Remove swarming battle armor success. Oh my god, he tore Amiel in twain. Amiel's still alive. He took no injuries, but there's only two of the units now. He just somehow swatted you off or something. Well, I'm not going to take the shot at him. I would like to get the scimitar away. Let's bring ourselves around. We have a line. What do we have out here for Ronin? Oh, dude, are we, are we hurt? Is Ronin okay? <laughs> What's this? Chameleon. Chem pulse lasers. Oh my god, they've got a lot of stuff. I will take a whiff at it. And a whiff. We need better battle armor for Amiel. Yeah. 
I've never used battle armor in any of my runs and generally avoided tanks, so it's interesting to me to see them seeing them used. We've definitely used them. Really, really like the battle armor. Really like some of the Vs, for sure. We're not dead yet, so that's always a plus. It was a delay on my swatting. Oh, okay. Waiting for orders. Well, he's moving closer. This guy is mostly exposed at one evasion, and I really don't want to shoot over towards where Amiel is, so we'll just kind of scooch a little bit. We've got direct line. Battle Lord, we're hoping to connect here. Roger that. Yep, that was a good connection. We got a breach. He still has rockets to worry about. What can I do for you? Hold. Sidle on over. We've got the arrow four. And shot. Yeah, yes, there it is. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful hit right there. We got served on the follow-up right here, right now. Shot up hill and send it. Oh, and a bit of a whiff. That's okay. Come on, get in there. We can always get our SRM back. Bring back the hover tank. Right into the damaged side. I love the fact we can just coast along the water and send it. There it is. And the stinger is down. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So that is half of the enemy forces. Very interesting. So this is our primary target. Oh, this is the assassination target, Chameleon. Interesting. I didn't make that connection. Both of his long range, his large pulse lasers are offline. I kind of want to get the heck out of dodge with Amul. I don't want him to lose his other half. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to mount on up while he can, and we will get the heck out of dodge and just keep this guy spotted with evasion, yeah? So we'll hold here. Hey. Got our scimitar, got our Yutake. So we're going to come it around and just keep sight. Like so. Consider me there. And hold. Up, and we're going to reserve down to one. So they have their Shadowhawk. He's got his Howitzer. Oh my god, that's <laughs> that's not good. Direct line of sight shots with the howitzer eight. One of them connects and AoE's probably pinged Amiel again. Okay, this is not Wait, what? What happened? <laughs> what what happened? He he didn't Man, he didn't want any of this. Heck yes. All right, bunnies. High five. Let's go. Get that guy. <laughs> I think we got ourselves a chameleon. <laughs> what was that? Target eliminated, bunnies. Great job. Incredible piloting. We can clean up any remaining hostiles now. Or head for that evac zone. Well, sucks to be that guy. That is the most amazing delivery I've ever seen. Here's a little bit of sniper. We'll just slowly whittle away at this guy. We got dead. It's, I mean, you know what? Let's just stay the heck away. That's crazy. And shot. Good connection. And unsteady. Perfect. So zero evasion for him. We've got the Tanner. Reserve and hold. Right now we've got eight evasion. You can still connect with that howitzer. Well, let's see if we can't bring our Yutake around. It's green right here. Well, let's do it. Here we go. That will be an extra $2.99 to be ad-free. Oh, no! Kid, we don't want to get... We don't want to get charged. Don't have them ixnay on the charges money thing. We don't have money. We're severely in the red. I would say we are we might even be the most red we've been in a long time. Too late. Oh, dread. I knew it. There are always darned fees. That's what. Hold. Hold. Let's see what he does. Hopefully he doesn't shoot the rest of Amiel out of the sky. Oh, shot to Vedette, but we actually have armor this time. Oh, 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 that's not good. Ixnay on the Adf day. I don't need a CD from... No, no, nobody needs to get charged by Comstar even more. Vedette, let's pull it back, pull it back. Clear the deck. Shot. There we go. Beautiful. Past threshold. Let's go ahead and start with the super accurate shots from HP. All right, there it is. Boy, did we call that one. And we've got done. Shot. That's looking good. There it is. And down he goes. That just means more loot and mix to salvage. Well, if we can destroy the loot on this guy, then maybe we'll get the full chameleon, right? 
All right, dead. I mean, I don't, I don't even know how to get up there, short of just going one at a time. Inner sphere. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, now's the time to dismount because we can double turn this guy. Here we go. He's. Oh, look, it looks like he's just chilling, having a picnic. Has he ever looked like he had shorter legs? I mean, look at this. This looks like he... <laughs> he looks like a little baby Shadowhawk. Look at, look at, if you just pretend like these are his feet right here. Let's, okay, okay, we'll stop. Here we go. Let's mount on up and hit this guy. Come on oh, with the two. Trip so hard, he phased into the hillside. Are right, we're boarding. We're boarding the Shadowhawk. Amiel, be gentle. Amiel, be gentle. Oh, yeah, you hit the arm. There we go. That's very gentle. Amiel, stay. Stay, Amiel. Be gentle. Be gentle. Hit on tor Great. Great job. Great job. And shot. Oh, 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 oh. Crit on gyro. Crit on core. Did he give up? Oh, he didn't give up. Oh my gosh. That's not good. We can't shoot at him. Uh, all right. Yutake, get out. Get out. If not for the clans, Comcast would have taken Terra and all the HPGs when the time was right. I mean, Comstar. Well, Amiel, you're on your own. We'll talk to you later. Danger close. No, 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 tank. There's only half of him left. Maybe we'll do a target ground. Nope, not going to do it. Not going to do it. Standing by. Hold. Keeping it cool. Reserve down. All right, what's he going to do? What's he going to do? Please don't swat the remains of Amiel. Oh, he's standing at an angle. His world is upside down right now. Oh, oh. Oh, he fell again. Okay, Amiel. Hang on, done. <laughs> Amiel, be alive. Be alive, Amiel. Be alive, Amiel. Well done. You managed to wipe the off for I can do an extract right now. No need to get to our plan, LZ. Hold, hold, hold. Wait, cross your fingers for Amiel. Cross your fingers for Amiel. All right, here we go. Here we go. Cross your fingers. So far, everyone's good. And Amiel's only out for 35 days. Heck yes. Nurse Bubba loves you. All right, great job. High five, Amiel. Will the Bunny League suffer a pile of loss? That is a resounding no. Congratulations to the bunnies and congratulations to Amiel. I kind of feel like Amiel was hanging on for dear life and the mech stood back up and it fell down when it tried to swing and he was like, ugh. And then when it fell, he basically just, I don't know, rolled into some hole that we created with a shell or something like that. Pretty darn good. We've got some options. We have a full shadow hawk on the menu we have a full chameleon on the menu i want that shadow hawk so we'll grab two and hope for the best three two and one three out of four all right three out of four one of the chameleon parts one of the javelin parts we got the howitzer we have some howitzer ammunition not too shabby at all so we've got three out of four on a shadow hawk we have three out of four on a Foot, on a footsie commando we've got three out of four on a periphery stinger and three out of four on a pegasus v all the other stuff is is stuff okay great the battle armor is a little bit busted easily to repair you can put me back on the list all right thank you so much well we got our battle armor small laser so we'll go one and two obviously they've got king david gauss rifles as well in the store but we'll hold off on those unfortunately they don't have the staying power All right, thank you so much for the volunteer, Sukalanti. Welcome back, sir. We actually need to sell some to cover our fees. Well, let's see, where are we at? Four days out? It'll be two days for armor. I mean, we can jump right back in. We don't even have to wait, yeah? Scrap the Hornet and Javelin parts. I think we already got rid of the Hornet. That was so fast for me to get rid of that thing. Dead or Alive 1 Skull B Team Battle in the Lowlands. This is against Tortuga Dominion again. And we got Dead or Alive against the Torian Concordate. This might be a little more spicy. So we're at 252. Sell the Clint. We have a Clint part? Is that true? Yeah, we definitely need to get rid of that. Oh, here's the Hornet part. Oh, I see what you're talking about. I didn't even see it. I guess we'll get rid of the Javelin part. Oh, the Chameleon. You mean the Chameleon. I mean, that's going to be worth quite a bit, right? That's fine. There we go. All right, perfect. Let's stop by the barracks. 
Yes, Here we go. Commander. Deaths on piloting all the big four. Perfect. Oh, no worries. No worries. Oh, man. We've got our got heat efficiency. I mean, I like the resolve generation called shot bonus. Standing by. Omega. I mean, let's let's apply the points, but maybe in the hall we have someone who's an omni pilot as a replacement. We'll get that piloting up. Now we're barely bunny broke. That's the way. That's the way. You just got to stay above full bunny broke, you know? And serve getting that gunnery. Training complete. Okay, let's go in and stop by the hiring hall. Really curious what they have there. Because, you know, we have the money to hire more pilots. <laughs> well, yep. we can get mech only bunnies, which is basically an amiel battle armor replacement and an investment go. for the future. Let's put it that way. And we also have another mech or I guess V only bunny. So this one costs the same. We can get noodle. You should give me sensor lock next. Yes, we need it badly. We need, we really need it badly. But let's hold off on this and into the command center. What can we do? Training day. I'm thinking dead or alive against the Torians would be fun. 2-9. We can go up to 2-11. So we'll just get the money here. And what do we got? Throw me in a Marauder with hardened armor and hard gel. You can drop arrows on me all day. Yeah, I... Wouldn't that be a dream? And we have no more bunny pilots anyway. So out we go. Amulets out, and here we go. One Skull difficulty assassination in the jungle. Will the Bunny League suffer a pilot loss? Five minutes on the clock, and we'll see what you got. We're only contracted for a single target here, but we both know it will not be easy. The war criminal you're hunting will not be alone. The company of Tory and Guard mercenaries that he signed on with will attack you on sight. Good hunting, bunnies. Oliver out. Hell's Heart Regiment, Pride of the Concordia, the Torian Guard, Drake. Oh, great. We've got we've got a superstar on our hands. Can we get across this way? This one. Okay, this looks shallow, and there's a landmass on the left. I think I'll default to the landmass. So off we go. I don't like those amphibians. They are so dumb. Okay. Wait, oh, which? Oh, the moose. <laughs> For battle armor, my top three are Krupp. Marauder and Gnome, but I do like Swarm Capable if I can get it. You hate this map? Well, the nice thing is they're far away. Usually I would say I'm not a big fan of maps that you have to cross a really long distance, but if we have to go through something and bypass this part, then I gotta say I'd rather be far away while I do it. You know what I mean? HB, moose are mammals. So what's he talking about? He said amphibian. <laughs> Atl oh, the axolotl. Oh my gosh. I'm the one who called up the axolotl. It helps you at this point. Don't have mechs, to be honest. Yeah, we have barely any repairs. Nothing to slow you down and no repairs at all. They just come right back. Granted, they're not exactly versatile in how you set them up and you can't rebalance them and stuff like that. But the upgrade is just, it's better. Soon we shall have all chaparrales. You know how much I like chaparrales. Hold and reserve. Okay, so what do we got? We're going to start with our... I keep thinking Dud, this pilot, is actually DVD. Which is okay by me. I mean, that's a pretty cool moniker, don't you think? So we got this guy up here. Well, let's get on around. Here we go. Full speed. And the nice thing about Vs, too, is kind of relaxing because you don't really have to think. You just kind of just sprint as fast as you can. It's kind of like playing with... Well, with lights. No. <laughs> hey there. All right, let's see what they got. Come on. What do we have here? Actually, we should probably keep a little distance for the Out arrow there. four. King triple D. Wow, that took a while. What do we have? It is a Hetzer. Oh my God. They've got an AC-20 Hetzer. They've got an Anubis with two mixed missile launcher fives and... A Scorpion with an AC-5. Okay. And then another mech back here. No idea what it is. Hey. Well, we have our work cut out for us. We got to start climbing. Oh no, here King DDD -D -D from Kirby. Oh, I hear DDD. -D -D. I immediately think of the chickadee, which is my one of my favorite birds out there. The black cap. Is it black? I think black cap chickadee. They're so cute. They are so, so cute. Oh, hello. Oh, it's a fire starter. Oh, it's a decent one, too. Light down, I will... Commander. Bunnies, we have a new target. Heck yes! Well, here I am trying not to die in my own run again. Well, don't worry. There are plenty of opportunities for all of us to die in our own runs. So who else? 
Is it just these guys and then the Torian, whatever he is, like super far away? The wanted mech warrior who's... Oh, he's not that far away. Oh, crap. Okay. Oh, man. Well, HB's ready. We're trying to get on up there. Give him a little bit of dazzle. 13%. Five. I guess we'll go for the... We'll go for the 13 on the AC-20. Hopefully, we'll burn some jungle. That would be excellent if that were the case. This is where I would like to have some battle armor. It would be helpful. Hello. Oh boy, there's that AC5 from the Scorpion. As one I have found, Google says Latin plural of Atlas is Atlantis. <laughs> well, you, I would definitely like to see the lost city of Atlantis. That's for sure. Let's hold. I am kind of worried. Once we get past this initiative phase, then that AC20 can take a shot. If it gets lucky, it's a bit problematic. Mixed missile launcher is probably shooting SRM rounds. He's got guns as well. But he whiffed it. They got another eight. That's going to be the fire starter. I don't think he can shoot the flames up that high. No, he cannot. All right, great, great. Well, let's get the Yutake on the move. We'll go eight evasion right here. And then we are still providing sight. That's fantastic. And let's see what that AC-20 tries to do. He might move forward into our Vs, though, which is probably worse. Don't forget you can melee with Vs. You can ram the enemy mechs if you feel... We can? Hey. I'm hitting V. It's not doing anything. Can I really ram the Vs? I feel like you're pulling my leg, but that's just too cool if that's the case. What? No. Well, tell you what. Let's go all the way down. Reserve down to one. The only one with sensor lock right now is HB, which means I have to get that arrow four close to the enemy so that I can assist with the evasion. They're too fast. Why am I in so we're moving. We're moving. Smart. You need an E50. You had to tell. Wait, what? You can? How do you do it? I don't understand. I, I want to know. I'm willing to know. All right, lock that guy. Bring him down. I'm so confused. <laughs> I feel like you're Stay pulling fine. my leg. Let's see. Well, we can definitely... Let's come in around here. We'll go... Okay. We might need to target the ground. I don't think shooting right there is smart. So we'll attack the ground. We'll hit on the high point. Engaging with target. Nice. We ping both of them. Soften them up. Maybe you can only charge. So you have to be sprinting. Basically, it is a charge attack. But won't we die? We really don't have... Oh, maybe that's the point. <laughs> All right, PPC, 37, coming around. There's the green. All right, I'll take it. Battle Lord, we don't have to worry about the heat. Oh, the enemy, wait, we got friendly fire. Just shoot before you regret it. All right, we pinged him one, love it. Let's go in and bring our AC-5 around the backside. Ronin, there's the green. Don't think about it too hard, just shoot. Keep shooting, keep shooting. He's got three on the backside. Best done with heavily armored high speed tanks. That we don't really have. Heavily armored is not a thing right now. And the green, that's why I like to see. All right, bunnies, here we let's tune up that machine gun and send it. Guns, guns. He's got 30. We got the breach in 30. World of tank players. <laughs> that's true. It's so true. All right, scimitar, scimitar. All right, here we go, here we go. We can back it on up. It's going to be on eight so omega can we get around can we get green we can we can do it come on come on full speed full speed eight evasion shots oh he's <laughs> i mean i don't want it but heck yes all right hold 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 they do have an ac20 they can shoot at us that guy's out of the fight ac5 right to the rear and he whiffs it hang tight hang tight hang tight so they do have the fire starter inbound i don't think we're gonna be able to pierce this guy fast enough okay hang tight six evasion five evasion he is above hold he didn't move he didn't move oh gosh i want to run i i actually want to run but hold on seven he has the chance. Okay, he's going, he's going. He's pulling in. AC-20. 
and he whiffs it. Oh my god, on a hover tank. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. Ballista, 47, nope. Danger, danger. Super danger close. Can we manage that? I don't think we're gonna hurt ourselves. Yeah, let's do it now. Battle Lord. Oh boy. Shot. And we land it. All right, beautiful. Fantastic. And of course, we do have that arrow for as well. We got to follow up with a fire starter if he should take it. He's got the flamers. He could burn the jungle. There he goes. There he goes. He does have a medium. Singleton. Okay, this is okay. This is fine. This is great. And we're not even risking a real bunny here. This is great. So reserve down. Does the Ballista carry any shape charge? If they did, that would be amazing. I don't think so. I think it's all high explosive. Does it really? Oh, I thought I clicked on it. I could. Well, Standing let's by. check. If it does, we should be shooting shape charges all day. We got HB 50-50 on the connect. There it is. Heck yes. And the AC-20 is off the field. How satisfying. The double ping and four salvageable parts on that AC-20 head, sir. That is terrifying accuracy from our artillery fire support team. Amazing jump. That was not 50-50. That was 100-100. That's what that was. Let's go. Let's get up there. Literal warhead on forehead. <laughs> Just regular sniper ammo. Okay, okay. All right, Surf Cole, get in there. Get in there, buddy. Get in there. We're going to get in there before him. Heads are going to heads, and heads are got blasted. All right, on nine, on nine. So he's got that AC5. He's probably going to push. He does have the high ground. He's on the high ground. And a connect. He's got a connection. I'm okay. Where did he hit? 125, 81. Oh, he hit on the left side, only did nine points of damage. Oh, that's crazy. I'm torn though. That fire starter, he's got. Let's hold. I want him to move first, but I think he, if he gets ballsy, he could absolutely kick or land on one of us. Doesn't look like he's getting ballsy though. Oh, the burn is all damaged though, but it's on the vedette. One of our more armored mech Vs. 30 armor left, but we are in the deep end of it. You know what? Everyone back off the line. Let's back off the line. Get out of here. Don't run over geothermal. Heat becomes two times on these. Oh my god. All right, get out of here. Get out of here. Pull back, pull back. We need to make way for their artillery bombardment. Down to one. Reserve down to one. They've got a good cluster here. I think we'll just spot with a Yutake at this point and pull away. Dertz, get clear of the blast. How's our damage? We're okay? I am worried about serve cold because he's already in the fire i can't exactly avoid it go how are we doing he's got 30 on the right side he's still good okay we are ready omega stay clear all right we're all clear bunnies we're all clear here we go we got shots precise strike 11 30 on scorpion hold I'm not going to take that shot. We're going to get close enough. We're going to lock down to zero. Lock up the fire starter. He's on 13. He's not going. All right, beautiful. We got... We'll just check. No shape charge. No shape charge. Just high explosive. 9% chance. We'll at least get closer. 11% will take it. Shot out. A little wide. That's fine. That's fine. Where are they going? I mean, the nice thing is they're grouped up. Oh, he might be immune to the sensor lock. Very interesting. He was at two. He's still at two. Shot AC5 miss. I think this is the right way to do this one. Hold. Let them commit. Let them commit. We've got them surrounded. We do have to worry about the fact that there is a mech warrior still out there that we haven't seen yet. Oh, he's going super, super high. Fair enough. Fair enough. He's got one evasion, though. Go on and bring... I think he's immune to sensor lock, so we'll just sh take hot shots at him. We need a yellow jacket or hawk moth. In the middle of a workout, and I just want to chime in and say, that cardio sucks. <laughs> hey, shots. Well, good for you, man. I'm very proud of you. That's freaking cool, dude. All right, here we go. Get lucky. 20. 13 on high. 
And a good connect here. We got a good connect. Beautiful. Houses. He still has one evasion. He still has one evasion. It's always sucked, but every time I step on a treadmill, it's a fresh reminder. That I understand. It never gets easier. It doesn't. It really, really doesn't. Oh, our chaparral is super close. Let's go to indirect. We got the shot. 37. Shot. Good connect. We got a good connection here. That is fantastic. Yeah. I'm back. What have I missed? Well, there's a fire starter up there, and we're just trying to whittle away at it while we keep the bunny safe. Yeah. We all died. It's a new career. No, it's a new career, but we haven't all died. Oh, look. A fire moth ran in at the end of the turn with elementals. Oh, my God. See, that's, that's one thing I'm glad I don't have on a V-start, yeah? All right, Omega. Well, that guy is opened up. If we can come up to the front side, which we absolutely can. Let's go ahead and aim it. We'll push him back to initiative phase six and take the shot. I saw some orange. He's unsettled. That's it. He's just unsettled. And back off, back off. What happens to the flavor packets if everyone dies? Well... I don't know. I mean, maybe we can... Whoever finds him can cook him on a V engine or something. They are internal combustion. AC5. And he actually connects, but we've got seven. I don't know if I should say, but we have seven. Let's get Omega out of there again. Pull back eight evasion. Get some distance. And hold. Reserve down. Ready for orders. Okay, well, I guess we're spawning for ourselves now. 47. We aim for the scorpion. It's got that AC5. Oh, that <laughs> that'll do. That'll do. Beautiful. Daria sells it on the open market as his... Oh, Drat, again. He always sells our stuff, I tell you. I mean, this guy's got to go, right? If it's not the wanted McWarrior. Oh, there he is. There he is. Visible. He's visible. Medium. Our sides are busted. We absolutely need to be directly facing. We might be able to assist, but let's get HP on it. HP's ready. Here we go. I mean, Darius never matches 401k. <laughs> 13. Oh my gosh. It's got four evasion. Just take the shot. We still have some kind of impact. He has 31 structure. I mean, in theory, the small lasers, if we get daring, can do it. But maybe we can push and get a line. I don't think we have it, but we'll at least get a little bit closer. Vigilance to keep us boosted on the next order. Aye, aye. Hover tank in. Here we go. Vigilance again. Oh, good. Beagle active probe. <laughs> wow, they're pulling out all the stops at Galanti. And hold. And Ronin. Coming around. Because if we can go before him, we should be able to really sway the chances in our favor that we'll be able to get shots on his open side because it's facing us right now. He is just the scimitar, basically. If we bring it on back, 16%. That's not very good. I'm not going to take it. So hold. He's definitely going to move. If I were him, I would definitely take this opportunity to move. Coming closer. Giving the burn a death. Okay, so he's spreading the damage out. Last time he shot at serve cold. Serve cold still Taking fine. Hit he commander. hit the left side. 56 armor there. He's still good. Three evasion, one less. So let's go in and I don't know. We'll just come around and just take pot shots at him. He's awfully difficult to hit this guy. A little obstructed. Fire. Good connect. We got a connection. Three armor. Omega. Well, you know... Let's get in on the blue. Here we go. Roger. Double time. Shot. Damage side. That's all orange. Heat sink down. Critical hit, Commander. How much is left on that side? He's probably hanging on by a thread. 20. He's got one structure. One structure on that arm. Awaiting order. All right, let's get on the on the back side again. Come on. All right, bring around, bring around. Oh, we can actually get to the backside here. Beautiful. And we've got machine guns tuned up times three. And guns, guns, guns. Come on. Oh, we have the breach. We have the breach. I guess that's enough BTA. Oh, Sukalante, I'm sorry. Glad you're having a better time. I mean, we, we are having a time. That's for sure. 
if we connect here, we're, we're definitely going to hurt our bunny. So we have to hold. So we just need to relocate and take this moment. There we go. You put the vedette in splash. Yes, I did. Lock him. And he is sensor lock immune. Oh, no. Okay, please don't go into melee. Please don't go into melee. He didn't go into melee. He didn't go into melee. No melee. All right, beautiful. He's out in the open and we are now clear. We're clear. Oh, we got lucky there. Elementals and two gnomes all double turn my sick. Oh, gosh. That's unfortunate, man. I'm sorry. We'll tell you what. Let's go in and clear the zone. Can we get a line? Oh, I don't want to go through the fire. I guess we'll just back off here. We'll face the other way. Still don't know where that wanted mech warrior is. We'll get Omega. Omega to come around. We've got the spot. Hold. I think the blast zone is clear. Commander. Although I kind of want to keep even more clear. So let's bring around. First contact. Oh my god. You're doing the uh the clanner start? Shot. Targeting for an alpha I know they're low percentage shots, but there are any shots at this point. Anything at all. Ronin. Here we go. Shot. And we connected. Love it when that happens. Here we go. Ballista. High explosive. Go! There it is! That was not gentle. Yeah, that was very not gentle. We got one part of it, though. I'll take it. Oh, jeez. All right. We have one more. Just the assassination target. And we have no enemy contact thus far. So let's go ahead and regroup. Where are they at? Yutake has them right here in the clearing. So let's start climbing. One and a half star diplomat assassination. Oh my gosh. That is quite a contract, my friend. Up we go. Gosh. No enemy contact yet. That has me a little bit nervous. I don't think that's the proper way to climb, but we'll see where we're at. We may not. We may just have to spot and basically bombard. It looks like there's a path up the beach. So maybe we start moving, start relocating. If we can get artillery up high, that's going to help a lot. Might just leave it and try another planet. Honestly, that might be best, yeah? I've definitely had times where I just cannot... I feel like I cannot make progress, and it... it I find it's usually... That's usually the right call. Like, just leave and come back to it later. Not that I do that every time. It takes a very strong will to do that, yeah? And hold. Okay, reserve down to one. We're going to start by moving our guys up the beach just in case. You never know if he tries to make a run for it, yeah? Where is this guy? Right? Hover tank, forward. Good thing they're fast. We can actually shift with some level of determination. Oh, no fire, no fire. All right. I know we can make contact immediately, but let's get Surf Cold at least into cover. Yes, a full overhaul. There we go. No idea what it is. No idea. Omega can find it, and then we'll know. So here it is. It is a Hephaestus. Oh, my God. So this guy's a war criminal, Hephaestus, and he comes with the two light AC-5s, SRM-8, and three medium lasers. Pretty potent. Pretty, pretty potent. What's up, boss? Here we go. Ballista shot. Send it. Taking the shot. Good connect. There it is. Fancy, Dan. All right. Keep moving. Keep moving. We want to keep climbing. Keep climbing. Greek goddess smiting. All right. Precise strike and send it. Arrow four away. As we're talking about. All right. Great. Great. Scimitar. We're trying to come up on the outside here. We got Omega. Omega can pull away. We're actually going to utilize Vigilance and pull away and try and flip entirely so that we're facing. And hold. Okay. Dead. It's on the move. Actually, hold. Down the one. Let's let him go. There's one evasion. Oh, that is so odd. This is the one that looks like it can launch like it's an aircraft carrier. And it can launch... Ooh, oh, 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 okay, that's not good. It can launch fighters out of its torsos. Look at that. That's crazy. 
This is definitely where you would stand in front of it, but put your hand behind and wave just to make sure. Oh, yeah, that's not an optical illusion. I can see right through that. All right, ballista. And shot. Firing on target. From downtown, good connect. And dead. On the move. Full forward. On my way, double time. How the hell did that get past quality? <laughs> it's a feature tank. It's a feature. Ride that ridge line and shot. So far, so good. Oh, I think we've got this on lockdown. We totally have this. And we have direct line of sight with our arrow four shot out. Heck yes. So now he's unsteady. Let's get in there. Try and open up the backside. And shot. Oh, he's he actually has decent armor on the back. Kind of reads like a heavy medium. I don't think the scimitar is going to be able to assist anytime soon before this thing goes down. On mine, one of those slots is filled with an arrow for... Does it actually... You know this... I love this about Battletech, well, Battletech in general. Just the fact that it's what you see is what you get. Do you actually see the Arrow 4 in there? I mean, I assume so, but I don't know. Oh, this is a little bit dangerous, but... Shot. Yes! Splash 2. The whole... Oh, that's so cool. That is so freaking cool. Commander. Wow, we're getting really, really nice shots with our artillery. It's definitely a saving grace for this start right now. Allowing us to combat much more lethal opponents. All right, pull it back, pull it back. We still want the line. Sprinting. And shot. Come on, get him down. On the ground, on the ground. And down he goes. Beautiful. Come on, he's going to take some fall damage. Bleeding out, bunnies. Let's get the heck out of Dodge. Let's, <laughs> let's go. Let's get out of here. Although, I can't resist. I do want to try just once. Sometimes you got to just for kicks it straight to the head. Shot out. All right. <laughs> Well done. You managed to wipe the offer out. I can do an extract right now. No need to get to our plan, Del Z. All right. Heck yes. So no injuries at all. I love it. Hephaestus. We'll take two. Is there anything else that we should pick up instead? Guardian ECM. That's nice. But we need chassis right now. So here we go. Three, two, and one. We have three out of four of a Hephaestus. <laughs> hey, Tank, guess what? We have another three out of four. Heck yes, all right, we're ready. Anubis part, Hetzer part, AC20, SRM4, all is good. All right, fantastic, beautiful. So we're gonna, all we need is one more Hephaestus or one more of basic, what, like three other mechs or something like that. Let's take a look, status report. What do we got? Mech bay, over to storage. Let's take a look. We've got three out of four of a Shadowhawk, three out of four of a Hephaestus, three out of four of a Pegasus V, three out of four of a FTSE Commando, and three out of four of a Stinger. The Anubis, probably not going to see it again, so we need the money. We'll get rid of that. The Hetzer, probably not going to get more parts of that, so we need the money. So perfect. 780,000, two days out, and we will have our battle armor back. Gotta love that. Amiel's still out of the fight. Hiring hall, we do have the options. We haven't really gone to the store, right? Oh, that's right. We bought a chaparral. <laughs> we did buy a chaparral. I forgot. I generally run four parts until I start burning out, then drop to three to make some fun mechs. Oh, you can do that midway? I didn't know that. It's not the hardware. That's a rogue tech problem by design. Oh, Commander. Yes, Commander. Amiel. Good to go. Dud. I really want to replace these guys. Omega, Omega Ronin. I think we have enough money we can replace our two guys although you know what we can't because they still have the omni specialization they can do both mech and v so that's that's not really too smart because we got a lot of these right so we may have to wait on this one this is v only which i'm not really a huge fan of so let's hold off let's hold off let's take a look at what else is available here law supply ambush convoy at one and a half skull capture base do a duel battle on the badlands Battle in the Lowlands. You know what? Let's do one more battle and we'll head on over to like a one skull world and we'll see how that goes. Two nine. Sure. Let's do it. 
I have this strange inkling that if we have been doing 211, we would have a full mech by now, but let's see how this goes. One Skull difficulty battle in the Lowlands. Will the Bunny League suffer a pilot loss? Five minutes on the clock, and we'll see what you got. Enemies detected in the area, bunnies. Move forward and clear them out. Remind these bandits what disciplined mech warriors can do. Oh crap, did he say disciplined mech warriors? Uh, Darius, we're not there yet. See, what do we got out here? They're on the top as usual. So hold, hold, hold. We really need sensor. No, we, we absolutely do. You're absolutely correct. You are not wrong. Hold. Waiting for orders. We could always get Roger, someone in sensor lock in the Utake. That would be ideal, I think. Aye, aye. But we do have fast movers, so I think this should be okay. Unlike the last one, this is a lot easier to climb, yeah? The bunnies don't know what disciplined mech warriors can do. I know. I, see, that's why we second guess ourselves all the time. Because we have no idea if what we're doing is disciplined or not. We just do what we do. You have to be mech warriors first before you can be disciplined mech Oh, Drat, we are only the bunny motor club right now. We're not even the bunny league yet. Hold. Wait, and HB, start the climb. Get in a rough terrain and hold. They got a V out there. So we know we got a V up front. I'm assuming they're a mix. Ooh. What do you think that is? Like 15? This is where having an AMS helps because you can actually see the number that it tries to shoot out even if it fails. So let's hold. The Bunny Motor Club, you have Cruise Miss. No, 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 it's still part of the Motor Club. They had those in our Motor Club, at least. All the way to one. And the Counter Reserve. Okay, that's fine. Let's get Omega on the move. Here we go. He's got the sight. What do we got? Oh, I think we see almost everybody. We have a... SRM 30 Hetzer. That's not good. We have more Vs. We have a Panther with a large laser prototype that's busted. And an SRM4. I mean, uh, this thing is more dangerous right now. See what it does. All bunnies have cruise missiles. It's how you join. Heck yes. They can't know what we're going to do if we don't know either. That is the true strategy, my friend. Four evasion. We've got two in the distance and we got another. So let's see what we can manage. We got serve cold in the vedette as far as we can and into cover and hold the head sir must die it's true it's true i'm just hoping it won't take out oh there's another okay we got another mech we got two mechs out here oh we have more than two mechs they actually have real large lasers maybe that is a shotgun to the face let us not put our face there good thing it's not a bunny's face it's just omega's face it was the alpha and omega and unfortunately he's the omega so it's the very end for him i i hope not but you know, it might be. You never know. Oh, boy. Hey. Scimitar. We're going to go wide. I just don't want to get in front of the uh, okay. SRM-30, if you know what I'm saying. And then we'll hold. I'm hoping it'll force it to go at some point. At some point, he has to take his turn, right? He probably doesn't, doesn't want to shoot at this. Because it's just not a good time. He has to shoot up. He has to shoot at 8 evasion. Oh, there we go. There it is. SRM-30 straight at the Utake. No connections. One connection. Two connections. 12 damage. 12 damage. Okay, that's... Thank goodness. So if we lose Dud or Omega, it's not technically a bunny pilot loss. No, well... Uh, I see what you're saying, Ronin. <laughs> I thought plenty long and hard about this, Ronin. You are very smart and crafty. 100% calm. 100% chaos. I guess 40%. We can do this. Oh, that is a good ping. If I've ever seen one, heck yes. 51 left on that guy. Off we go. He has zero evasion, poor guy. Panther up. SRM4. And a whiff. So, so far, there have been 34 SRMs and a couple of large lasers fired at this thing, and it's taken exactly 12 points of damage. Hover tank. PPC. Come on, deaths. Shot out. Two SRMs at seven apiece. That also looks like an SRM-4. It is an SRM-4. Heavy wheeled APC-2 machine gun SRM-4. And we have the Chaparral. 
shot. Wow, our tactics pretty bad. But hey, now we're pinging for two. That's great. I'm curious who else is on the turn order right now. We haven't taken any additional incoming fire. And this guy has zero evasion. Oh, we have more mechs. More mechs. A javelin with an LRM-15. So we got hit with like four or five of those. But it's been spread out. And the flip. Okay, so, so far we know of six on the field. We've got four mechs, two Vs. But there's probably more out there. All right, we'll catch you a little later, tank. Hang tight, hang tight. That was the APC. The Hetzer is on seven. It's on seven. So we have to take the turns that we have right now. So what do we got? We've got the green. Bring her around. He doesn't have the evasion yet. We're all the way at six. Not to the Javelin. Shot to Hetzer. Right to the rear. Soften that up. Panic level critical indeed. I don't think he can punch out though. And a whiff. Thank God for speed. My God. All right, Omega. Let's go ahead and shift combat. We're coming around. Obviously, our back's a little bit to the head, sir, which I'm worried about. It'll be full value for those that connect. But, I mean, six was already plenty. Ooh. Oh, my gosh. That connected. That connected from downtown. We have almost 50 armor left on the right side. I'm never going to underestimate evasion after this one. Going to want to focus on guts and tactics. Well, I'm going to get every bunny to four first before choosing a skill. So just, just as a heads up, but gotcha. That's basically how I'm building HBFT right now. We got guts and tactics. So we have bulwark and sensor lock to start. Question with mods. Is there a safe site to download them from? Hey, Dracfracken. Absolutely. The nice thing about BTA, they run their own website. So it's BTA3062.com. If you want a direct link, you should be able to go right there. There you go. Oh, thank you so much, Deaths. Okay, so far so good. We've got Dud. He hasn't... They're all grouped up right here. He has two evasion. All right, we're going to key up Battlelord increased damage Commander. output, but also Commander. two accuracy and shot out. There it is. Oh, fancy Dan. And the SRM-30 is off of the field. Lethal damage, but not gentle. Well, I guess by nature, it is not gentle and no salvageable parts of that. But you know what? That's okay. We don't want that anyway. All right, we're com coming all the way around. Yeah, no worries, Drac. Welcome, by the way. And go ahead, 1756, and send it. Good connect. And that left side is down to 16. 16 armor, so 20 or 31 between armor and structure. Coming on in AC5. We've got the line right on the edge. 29. We'll get close enough. We're down to 42, so up we go. Mostly gentle, for the most part. For the most part. Firing. And hold. And then we have our arrow four. We'll keep climbing because we might need a sensor lock, yeah? Twenty, twenty-two, thirty to Panther. That'll do. That'll do. He's getting soft on the backside. So so far so good. I was really worried about the SRM thirty. I was very surprised at the very, very lucky hit with a large laser from across the ravine. And they are trying to go in for the kill, so it might be time to get Ronin on the far side of the hill. Yes, so we got Ronin. We are moving, moving, moving. We have that Panther there with the SRM4, but we'll give our strong side to him. That's the left. Shot. Oh, very good salvo right there. Zero evasion on that Panther. Shot to Vedette. We still have the armor on that one. The mod looks cool. I'm kind of curious if they have an exosuit mod now. Uh, when you say exosuit, you mean like battle armor? Is, is that what you're talking about? Or no? And it is very cool. Very much love the mod. We've got eight still. Eight still. All right. Bring her around. Here we go. 
So our spotting is working wonders right now. 42 or on the javelin. I kind of feel like I'd, I'd really like to connect here if we get so lucky, but we whiff it. That's okay. He still only has 31 of armor and structure on his right side, which is the closest sign to our artillery. But I kind of feel like we should be focusing the panther. Oh, geez. Okay, that's... That's not good. They've got line of sight on us. We might want to come back on down or maybe keep progressing. Actually, I think if we can clear the enemy on the top of the hill fast enough, oh my god, HP's in trouble, then we might be able to get a break line of sight to the open side right here, yeah? Battle armor are implemented. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. That's like 4% chance to miss with all of those. Oh, geez. Ballista, 34, 28, too close. Shot to Panther. Good connect and a breach. Beautiful. Zero evasion. Dead. Aye, aye. Coming around. We need the speed. We don't want to be in the fire at all. PPC to the rear. Full value. Crank it up. Battle Lord plus two accuracy and shot. Good got. connect and the breach in the backside. He's got eight structure, complete and utter crit straight to the core. Reporting. Whoever's behind the laser is commendable gunnery. I know. I wish they could totally work for us, right? We can make them a bunny. Panther is man. down. Beautiful. So let's go ahead and try and get on the far side of the hill. If we can engage from here, we should hopefully be safer against the incoming laser fire. Going turbo. But it AC5 double tap and pop. Right, Commander. Good connect. We got a breach down to nine. Oh man. And HB. You HB's going for <laughs> the super danger close move. Or better yet, can we get in and just should I go super danger close? Like with medium lasers, danger close? Is that smart? That's probably not smart. I mean. That's okay. Here we go. I got the speed <laughs> I'm not going to shoot the arrow forward, but I will shoot everything else. Here we go. I saw a little orange. Oh, it's not enough, though. Nice. I meant battle armor. I'm used to calling it exosuit due to the tabletop game master. Yeah, no worries. Honestly, My grandma. I think there was there was a cartoon I used to watch, which I really liked. I think it was called, Ex is it Exo Squad? Does, has that, have any, is that right? Do any of the bunnies know what I'm talking about? Oh, are we going through the fire? I don't want that. Let's come around the backside. This mod has battle armor. Heck yes, it does. And send it. There it is. And the APC is out. Actually, correction. I just noticed under Gunnery 8, there's actually a battle armor master skill. Really? I did not know that, Amiel. I did not know that at all. Exo squad. That Oh, heck yes. You know what I never understood but always thought was cool? You know the X-Men Gambit? And actually, a lot of the X-Men, they've got... Or XCOM, the OG XCOM, they've got this... I don't know what it is. They wear this thing on their head. It's like a a border for their face. <laughs> for, for lack of a better description. But I always, I always thought of that as like, oh, they're elite. They're super cool. <laughs> can, we, can we get eight evasion still? There we go. We still have sight. Perfect. It's in the Battletech Advanced Wiki section. It's the rank 10 skill for gunner. Oh my gosh, yeah. Old. So we've got two really close to us. The Javelin and the Panther on the ground. And then we'll have eliminated eliminated the end. Oh no. Oh, and he whiffs it. Trying to DFA the Bunny Man himself. What a... What a... What a cheeky guy. What a cheeky guy. Panther on the stand up, malice to hit, and he whiffs it as well. Wow. The nerve. The nerve. Trying to bunny hop on the bunny man. My goodness. What do they have in the distance? Also, another panther with a large laser prototype. Oh, jeez, Louise. Man, they are dead shots with this thing. 17 armor left. Yeah. You need to shoot him with your guns, HP. Give that guy a love tap. <laughs> We might explode, but that's okay. Commander. All right, so we got Dertz. We want to pull back. So what we're going to do, we're going to use one of Dertz's techniques and use the shift movement and just pull ourselves away without going into the fire and hold. This way, we're not going to take additional laser fire from across the ravine. We've got Serve Cold with the Vedette. Surf Cold is going to do something that every bunny has wanted to do since the dawn of time. Do you see this firing arc, this trajectory? Here's Serve Cold. He's got green, just like any bunny would want to see. 
He's got an AC-5 primed and ready. He's going to shoot here, but look who's on the other side. So if serve cold, I'm giving you permission to fire in this situation. That's right, serve. So count yourself blessed. Here we go. <laughs> Cross your fingers. <laughs> Three, two, and one. Right, commander. And serve lands it. I never doubted him. Not for a second. Heck yes. Shoot the butt. I had a Marauder trying to DFA my Firestarter earlier today. Needless to say, he got a swift kick to the backside, followed by my many middle fingers. A doom. That is the way, Serini. That is the way. Well, tell you what. Let us stay indirect still. We're going to go for that Panther. Shot out. That's a connection. If I've ever seen one, beautiful job by Dud. Heck yes. All right. What do we got? What do we got? NHB with a Chaparral. We're coming around. We got the shots straight, of course. Stack that guy. There it is. Imagine if Mex didn't. <laughs> Hold. So he's not really spotting for his friends right now. So they've got to go and get their own intelligence. We've got our scimitar. Hang tight. Don't even move. Take the shots. Come on, get out of there. Yeah, yes, and out he goes. Beautiful. Four salvageable parts on the javelin if we show so choose. Let's go down to one. Counter reserve. They don't have sight anymore. So they can't take those long range shots. Omega. Full speed. Full speed. Here we go. Imagine if mechs didn't always fall backwards. That javelin would have fallen directly on HP. They've got a black. Oh my god. Look at this beauty. BJ2. Streak SRM8 and two ER large lasers. If we could get that, that would be amazing. And then they've got the prototype Panther out there as well. Well, let's see what we can do. We got precise strikes, 40, 40 on Blackjack. You know, Battle Lord, here we go. And shot to Blackjack, 31. We went wide right to the Panther. We ping both of their Blackjacks are great early game mechs, yeah. It can be disabled. Are you talking about the, uh, the friendly fire? What can I do for NHB, you? Panther, Arrow 4, Blackjack. Shot. Wide, wide. Gonna hazard a guess the Blackjack is behind all the long range. Stand yeah, on. maybe. Maybe, Ronin. I would imagine so. Let's break line of sight. We need the same tactic. They have too much accurate firepower. Everyone get in the water. Hide. <laughs> this is like Battleship now. If they had indirect fire, they'd be trying to call out coordinates and try and hit our bunnies. I'd prefer team damage for some sort of immersion. There is, we have full friendly fire on right now. Took a break, came back for the shot. Thought your target was a vehicle and the mech was yours. I crossed my fingers the wrong way. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. All right, Yutake. Well, that guy is probably weak in the butt. So here we go, bring it around, focus, push him back to initiative five, send it. Soften him up. Oh, yeah. They, he has a decent amount of armor there. I don't think that's going to do much, but let's get on down. In the water, bunnies. Get in the water. Hold. Yes, AMS is in the mod. Both laser AMS, standard AMS, clan AMS, you name it. 28. You know what? Go. Acknowledge. Oof. Oof. Bunny hot tub time. Heck yes, you all deserve a break. That's what I thought. So I figured I would all let you cool off in the tub. I'm that kind of guy. Oh, laser is a thing now. Yeah, laser AMS is there. Absolutely. Even HB is going to get in the tub. 22. Oh, fine. We'll go for this. Arrow four away. Man, eventually we'll run out. We actually need to hit our targets. Oh, all right. Two evasion. That's all he's got. Okay, beautiful. Hold. Panther on the move. Oh my god, he actually connected there. We've got 12 bunnies. We have 12. I imagine laser AMS is kind of hot running. It is. It absolutely is. But you don't need the ammunition, right? So that's a thing. Well, eh, I guess... I guess we can do this and give him the butt because our butt has the most armor right now and we get eight evasion here. So come on, Blackjack, take your shot. They're the ones in a ravine now. It's true. They are. 
Laser AMS has been nerfed a fair amount, though. Oh, that's that's decent amount. But it went to the butt, so it's okay. Almost better to use Clan AMS if you have it. Well, Clan AMS is is awesome, for sure. I has returned. Are we broke? Nope, not broke at all. You know us. We get close, but we never hit the bottom. Well, we have hit the bottom, but... Engaging. And this guy's about to hit the bottom of the ravine. Heck yes. Come on, deaths. Hold. What can I do At HB. You? Shot to Blackjack. That went wide as well. Man, we're just shaving off the armor in the backside at this point. Oh. Oh, how's the butt? Butt's okay. There's eight armor still. Oh, boy. Come on, bunnies. We got to hit this now. I had to switch out to ballistic AMS or else I couldn't even fire my guns. <laughs> you know, understandable. Completely understandable. Shot. Oh, oh, he's got six armor now. Gosh, we're being so gentle. You know what? Let's let's get in. Let's start working that panther. Apply the pressure, bunnies. Apply the pressure. We've got the PPC battle lord plus two accuracy and send it. Went high. Ping away, ping away. He's got 18. Panic level critical on the prototype. Get the bidet out there. We've got the angle. We got the shot. Focus pushing back on the initiative order. Send it. AC5. Ping on leg. He's already critical. No effect oh, on... You got me. No effect on his morale. Coming in from the flank. Shot. 50. 50-50. That's a hit. Beautiful. He is now stressed. I would have been stressed a long time ago. Scimitar. Oh, through the fire. Don't want it. Coming around. Coming around. We've got the flank. He's already unsteady. Zero evasion. Scimitar's up. Send it. Full salvo. Almost on knockdown. And Omega coming on in. And we got, we've got the green. He's not opened up here. This is the left side. He has 18 armor and he's got breaches on legs. Send it. I saw a little orange there. Orange in the middle, 66 structure left. So we got eight evasion. We are super close right now. He's got streak SRM eight on. Surf cold's good. He's in the vedette. I would have been stressed a long time ago. That's why you're the boss and not the pile. <laughs> yes, Commander. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? What do we got? Oh, they're close together. Shot for the ages 47. Battle Lord plus two accuracy. Shot. Taking the shot. Wide. Oh, no. Out he goes. No, 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 no. Wait, okay, that was a panther. That was a panther. What about the blackjack? Blackjack, blackjack's in there. He's currently on, he's on panic. He's on panic. Come on, Debs. He's already moved. We get to do whatever we want. Actually, hold, hold, hold. What about, if we want to be gentle, we definitely want to go in the narrow four. Here we go. <laughs> Why am I in a car? Okay, we want to be gentle, right? Of course we want to be gentle. Here we go. Arrow four, shot. Oh! Oh! We were a little too gentle. Okay, my bad. Good job, buddies. The people can get back to their lives again. Ah, Trent. I don't know what happened. We were trying so hard. Will the Bunny League suffer a pilot loss? That is a no. Congratulations to those who had the faith. He was an adventurer until he took that arrow four straight to the noggin. All right, let's go and flip it over. Let's see what we got. We definitely don't have a full blackjack too. That I know. ER large laser. I mean, that's incredible. But we are needing mechs pretty badly. Panther. We have a potential of a full panther. I mean, I guess, I guess we'll do it. What do we got? Three, two, and one. We got the blackjack part. Half of a javelin. Half of a panther. We'll take it. Beautiful. We've got almost a million sea bills, as is normal around the Bunny League. That's right, I guess. So let's stop by the barracks, see what we've got. Amiel. Well, Amiel wanted... Well, I know you said you wanted the Battlemaster stuff, so we'll get you up that gunnery tree. Dertz. Okay, Dertz gets to choose now. Amazing. So Dertz started with Battle Lord. I did not assign Battle Lord to Dertz. So HB will hold on Dertz for now. Why am I in a cockpit? I want to bring this all up to six, which would be great. We'll go over to Ronin and bring that all up to four. Perfect. Uh, we got Serve Cold. Serve Cold getting up there. We'll get you closer to Sensor Lock. There we go. And now we've got Dertz. So Dertz can choose. Yeah. 
500k on training module. Oh boy. Oh boy. Have you killed me off yet? No, not at all, the Riddick. It's a new career. So, Dead, are you okay? So, Battle Lord, I wouldn't normally put Sensor Lock and Battle Lord together. I have. Hmm. I have half a mind to give you sure movement or give you Bulwark. I feel like Bulwark is the easier choice. But you're you're typically like a melee guy, you know what I mean? Sure movement? All right. Thank you so much. There we go. So now you're the dodgy dodgy guy with all the heavy punch, right? So we can do mech work later. All right. We can retrain you later for melee. And I know we don't have the right pilots. I just want to double check before we go. Yeah, these are all we've got mech only pilots, V only pilots. We're looking for that really, really elusive mech and V. I'll call it an Omni pilot for lack of a better word. If we go over to the mech bay, I think everyone is fine because we don't really have mechs and the battle armor is two days away. We've done a lot within the same day because we don't have repairs. It's kind of quite novel to me. I had no, I, I didn't really think about it. Yeah. Let's head over to the navigation screen. We can get on out. I know that we're leaving chaparral's behind, but hey, bunny's going to keep moving, right? Let's bump it up to a one skull. I think we can manage. We've been able to kind of do one skulls pretty regularly. Yeah. So very, very close by arid world electronics, moderate population. Is there anything that's kind of more near a conflict zone? One skull in Sirdar. Inner Sphere. Ooh, Ice World. I love Ice World. So we've got this over here. Arctic World. I love that as well. Alien Vegetation Recreation. I mean, between the two, I guess moderate population would be nicer because then we could at least cause some damage to buildings. That's what we like to do here at the Bunny League. And we'll start heading our way towards Capellan territory. That's awesome. Yeah. Oh, geez, Louise. I cannot resist. We're going to buy that. Um... <laughs> All right, let's go before I buy anything else. Cool. Command center. What do we got? Freaking cool mod. Heck yes. I like the portrait mod. I use it with Battletech Advance. I also made a bunch of anime style portraits. Got tired of so many of my pilots being twins or triplets. I don't know why, but the story reminded me of the underwater level in the Ghost Bear Legacy game. That was the worst. Oh, no. Oh, the Maginot line. I like the sound of this. Do you remember on the last Saturday stream, we ended up running our own Maginot line 2.0. I think this sounds great. So we've got three pick okay maybe three pick 12 not three pick 15. we're going with three pick 12 it's a one skull difficulty battle in the tundra polar biome amiel is not quite back yet oh but he can go into battle amiel you cool all right let's do it well amiel is going back in one skull difficulty battle in the tundra will the bunny league suffer a pilot lost five minutes on the clock and we'll see what you got here's the thing we forgot to check the hiring hall. Maybe they actually have pilots that are not bleeding out and should be in the med bay. This is the map grid we're tasked with clearing. Sweep the area, find any enemy guns and bunkers and destroy them. All right, you heard the man. In the name of the Chancellor, Warrior House Imbara will defeat any who dare raise their hand against the Capellan. Oh, uh, he said the magic word. I cut off the comm. Sorry, I couldn't finish this. Couldn't finish his sentence. All right, what do we got here? Full reserve. We totally forgot to preload. Destroy weapon emplacements. Hopefully they're fixed and cannot move. Then it is the true Maginot Line 3.0. We'll get Amiel. Am oh, Amiel's already injured. This is very dangerous. I don't like this at all. Whose idea was it to bring Amiel into combat half cocked? I thought we repaired this. Note to self, preload. Yes. You can get mobile HQs on every house capital. No need to ally for those. You know, maybe we don't deploy Amiel on this map. <laughs> this was a bad idea. Whose idea was this? I, I honestly don't know sometimes where these ideas come from. What do mobile HQs do? Well, I'm glad you asked. They're super cool. They have the ability to summon down turrets, summon down, uh, what was it? Was it mechs? No, turrets. They summon down a bunch of stuff. They can summon down a bunch of things and they can also provide cover like electronic countermeasures. They can do uh, sensor sweeps, things like that, I think, right? Who wrote that note from his doctor? Great question. I don't know. They allowed him to go into combat already. Nurse Bubba is out to get you, Amiel. I think we should reconsider his employment. 
Let's hold. Can you get the mobile mech base they had in, I think it was Mech Warrior 3 that can repair rearm mechs? So there is the J27 transport, which typically I laugh at, but it can actually re like reload. It's like if you run out of ammunition, I think it actually will reload your mechs, believe it or not, yeah? Ah, he argued with Nurse Bubba and this is his payback. Oh my. I guess you just got to learn your lessons sometimes. You can call down off-map turrets, mechs, battle armor, or Vs. Ah, there you go. Thank you, Dad. There are ones I think can do mech drops as well, but I like getting them to do... Oh, that's the one. The airstrikes. That's the one. You can call for airstrikes with the mobile HQ. Those are really powerful. Mind you, they do cost C-bills every time you do it. So that's something to keep note of. You do want to keep a reserve of cash because you're basically shooting cash at the enemy. But you know what? They're actually very efficient uses of your cash. Let's be real. You don't have to get repairs off of it, too. There are repair vehicles, yes. But the turrets are cheap. They're super cheap. They're like 10,000 C bills each, and they go until they're destroyed. If you think about that, that's crazy. That is very, very cheap. Yeah, 10k decoy. And it seems like the AI will target those things quite often. I'm not saying all the time, but I mean, those are shots not going to your mechs and your crew, right? It's fantastic. We absolutely need beacons. We just need platforms first, which is why we're trying to get some mechs, yeah? We actually got, I believe, in the initial box when we went to the mech bay, we actually got a beacon. I don't remember. Oh my god, what have we done? Locust, single medium laser. All right, UAC 2 sniper turret with 28 armor. That's it, and 12 structure. Okay, we can manage that. Just don't get shot, don't get shot, don't get shot. No shots. Oh my god, wow, we connected with a lot of those. What the heck was that? Sniper turret. Well, it was a sniper turret, but HB is on the case. So no worries. Or what can I do for you? Yeah, HP's on the case. <laughs> Hopefully this will connect. Shot out. Wasn't even worried. Heck yeah. <laughs> All right. We're still fine. Everyone's alive for the most part. All right, let's go. Come on. If you get a beacon, can it be used battle after battle or is it a one-off? You can keep using it. There's just a limit within that battle, that single battle. So if you put the... I don't like that at all. If you if you put the beacon on the mech, like the turret beacon is only one ton. It takes up one crit slot and it actually will allow you to summon two turrets. There's a cooldown in between, but a two maximum turrets within the, uh, within the whole battle, right? Most turrets are permanent contracts. Yes. Brush your shoulder off after that shot. Heck, yes, I will. Is it still 10k for hardened turrets, or are they more expensive? That I don't know. We haven't seen the hardened ones. Oh my gosh, everyone is a track shot all of a sudden, shooting into the sky, shooting a Yutake out of the said sky. Scimitar. We've got long range. I don't know if we can connect with these guys. Three evasion. Oh, that's not looking so great. So let's go. Oh my god, we are so inhumanly fast. Amaze balls. You definitely are, Ronin. You're going very, very fast, Glumrus. Most mech contracts are one shot. Now, the standard mech is the Irby with the AC-10, and it's a little bit expensive. It's like 100,000 per drop. So that's a little bit rough. Okay, we... I... I'm thinking if we get to this side of the hill, then it will at least cut which weapons can shoot at us in half. That's my hope. But now we have a lot of intelligence. We've got a lot of these enemy Vs out here. We have SRM-12 Scorpion. We have an HVAC... HVAC-8 out here. Sniper turret. Locust. Pack rat, su pack rat support vehicle. We were just talking about support vehicles. Okay, hold. What's up, boss? All right, Ballista Battle Lord. We got the shots. We want to hit that HVAC if possible. Shot out. And clear. Beautiful. That's what we're talking about. Anti-air is down. I mean, at this point, that's basically our Sam. And he whiffs it. All right. So far, so good, bunnies. No dead Amiel. No dead Omega. All right. Move, move, move. Here we go. Move. We got to start climbing. Undercover. Makes me think of under pressure, undercover. 
drop me on one of those tanks. You got it, Amiel. Even though you have two injuries, you sure? We might accidentally hit one of them with a little bit of danger close, you know what I mean? But you need to buy con... Oh, we're fine. But you need to buy contracts for heavier or even hardened turrets, and those upgraded turret contracts may easily be a million. You have them constantly available once bought, though. Yes. So, I mean, it's a great investment, for sure. All right, we're out in the open with the Vedette. We'll take full damage. 10. Oh, he's got tag. That's unnerving. We'll try and ping him. We got to cross this hey, little land doctor. bridge right here. Were those... I think that's a mortar turret. I think they got a mortar turret out there. The basic turrets are super Minor squishy. Damage, Hard damage. part is getting HP to... I know, I know, Vergent, but here's the thing. Damage. This career, we're going to do it. You know why? Because we need a juggernaut. And we can only buy it. We can't win it. You can only buy the juggernaut that we need, so... It's going to happen this career. You will see the once in a lifetime situation. That's right. I'm on my way. All right. What are we shooting at? 30 on pack rad. We've got that locust 13, 11, 22 on scorpion. Sure. We'll go wide. Okay. A little bit. We'll take it. I love the fact every time you shoot, you're getting some kind of value. I don't like that at all. They've definitely got a lot of these AC2 style turrets out here that I'm not enjoying. I'm going to hold one. We're going to hold until this Yutake can move. I want to center Amul on his drop. What is a juggernaut? Sorry for... No, please ask as many questions as you want. So much I don't know. Well, here's the thing. We just discovered recently, or I just discovered recently. I didn't know about it. There is a juggernaut on Solaris 7 that you can buy. That has 20 support weapon hard points. And I really want it. <laughs> That's a lot of support hard points. You literally cannot run an XL engine if you want to run all 20 hard points. Can you imagine the AMS coverage you can have in a 20 hard point? It would be a lot. It'd be really hilarious. And you'd burn through all your armor in the first burst. Can you imagine if you overload that? Wow, that'd be amazing. <laughs> but it would be fun. It'd be so much fun. Okay, let's hold. No problem, Ronin. Not like we tape a cat to you for seven missions after your toy. Oh, that would be a joy. Oh, wait, he's allergic. Crap. I forgot. Oh, thank you, Death. Yes, the Juggernaut. That's correct. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. We can get hit by guns. That's horrible. There she is. Hold. They're not taking us to eight. So that that is it right there. Oh, hello. Oh my gosh, they're actually landing consistently now. This is not good. Take a look at this. That's crazy. Can we zoom in here? I think we can zoom in here. There we go. Look at all those machine guns. <laughs> That's so good. Oh, it's, it's a dream. That's what it is. It's a freaking dream. That's amazing. So could you load it with 20? I guess you probably could. Hey. That would be a good time for sure. A bad time for your enemies. I know that. Off we go. Hey. Best put the BTA wiki on a bookmark. So it's so much fun to just browse through there. I mean, oh, if you're... Right. You'll probably be shopping a lot in the game afterwards, though. All the rotary smalls. Oh my gosh. Clan small rotary pulses. If you could manage to get that many. Get a bunch of piranhas and just cannibalize them. Think of loading that out with rotary mag. Oh my gosh. Any rotary anything, if you can fit it all and manage the heat, would be insane. And what's crazy about the small, the clan small rotary pulses, they're actually super heat efficient. You know? That's just nuts. Alright, what turrets are these? I bet they're UAC 2s or something. Mortars. Okay, that's gonna go. HVAC 2s. Yep. Alright, well, let's work it. Looking pretty good. And that's down. And then we just have the HVACs. Once the turrets are offline, that's going to be huge for us. Goodbye, Maginot. Come on, you got you to gotta survive this, bunnies. You got to do it. 20 clan AMS. The Iron Dome. Yes. Well, bunnies, actually, if you want to see what a lot of AMSs look like, join me on YouTube. Because, <laughs> because we just rolled the Bard class for our Juggernaut on YouTube. So that means it's loaded out with AMS and ready to go. So that'll be a lot of fun. Hell, just normal mag shot. That'll, that'll work too. I will. I would definitely take that if we rolled correctly. Uh, let's see. We can get down 
I don't know if I want to drop just yet. Let's hold. Hold again. On yeah. six, we got our ballista ready. Galleon Locust HVAC. Shot out. The shot. Good connect. All turrets are down. Beautiful. Totally free. Right? That's right. We rolled Bard right at the very end. That's why I love small laser, super heat efficient for damage output. The clan small rotary pulses are almost like, I hate to say it, like they're almost, almost small laser efficient, not quite, but they shoot three times. That's ridiculous. And shot. Good connect. And the breach, 12 right there. Fantastic. Vedettes up. Bring her over. And 42. And by the way, bunnies, we are very, very close to the end of time for tonight. But don't worry because this is that every other Saturday, meaning this Saturday, we will get to go for six hours. So new career, we'll get to really dive into it and try our best to save money, right? <laughs> I said try our best. I did not. Let's just. Wait, I just want to call wait, out. Wait, I did wait, not wait. promise that we would smart. save money. I was just saying that we were going to try to save money. Okay. Just smart. in case this is recorded or anything, right? So 56 shot should be enough to drop him. Beautiful enemy down. We got three left. It's that locust. We've got the SRM 12 beast of a V back there. Yeah. Yutake Amiel. Let's hold on Amiel. and hold meaning bunny broke too many toys someone has to play with all of them it's true it's true it's a hard life but you know what problems exist in all kinds of shapes and sizes and sometimes no one can really say what problem is worse than another either you have bubble gum stuck on the bottom of your shoe or you just you, you can't even afford to i don't know it's all bad <laughs> The moment HB will tell us he ground out 20 million C-bills off cam. No, no, I wouldn't do that. I mean, maybe I would. I don't know. I haven't thought it through. Should I? I should. Maybe we should have run all Vs before this. Turns out bunnies are snipers with artillery. Maybe we need all artillery. So bunnies, this is true. It is actually a dream of mine. I had a dream once that we had all Shiltrons. All Shiltrons and a couple of long toms. That was my dream. And I think we can finally live out that dream as long as Omega doesn't die. What? No. Let us go. Actually, you know what? Bring it all the way down to one. That's going to allow us to open with artillery. 47, 18, and 72. Shot. Good connect. All right, beautiful. Splash two. Yeah, no, I believe if HB said Raven ground out 20 million off stream. You know, she has done quite a lot for this channel. I really wouldn't put it past Raven. Is this smart? I would believe it as well. She is a beautiful, beautiful woman. Locust 9. There we go. Pack Rat. Arrow 4. Adventurer. Uh, well, he took an arrow and he's still adventuring. All right. Come on, Vedette. We got the line. See, I really don't understand why the bunnies think that I can't save money. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I... No, I totally understand why you say that or why you think that. I, I think that too. That's, you know, that I was just trying it out. You know, sometimes you have to say things out loud just to see how it how it sounds. I, it sounded pretty ridiculous. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done that. All right, let's go in and shoot. She'd probably spend more time fighting and less time traveling. I won't say it. No, I really won't. Well, she'd just play to listen to the soothing sound of Amiel remembers. That's right. Raven actually finds incredible mass quantities of AMS that basically it sounds like a 100 a10 warthog shooting off their vulcan cannons at once she finds that sound soothing she said oh it's so pleasing i said i can't even hear myself think when that many ams are going off at the same time i literally have to stop talking while streaming yeah but hey she's the dominant sow that's true she is the most dominant of sows she'd probably spend more time fighting and less time tra uh yes that's true ah oh, man i i, I kind of feel like Raven would be better at streaming than I. <laughs> Even he can't. Oh. Thank you so much, Tank, for the clip. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Let's hold. Keep Amiel safe, bunnies. Keep Amiel safe. 
We have a lot to do, and we cannot lose Amiel this early in the career. We've never lost Amiel, by the way. He's always survived. And that I... Oh, not good. The first melee. Barely hit, Commander. Oh, thank... Oh, thank God. I'm so used to mechs. If they step on a V, it's like insta-kill. So I'm so happy that that was not an insta-kill. The nice thing is it doesn't really have evasion anymore now, does it? Oh, it does have evasion. Never mind. <laughs> it has a lot of evasion. Okay. Well, let's get a move on. We got to get away from that guy and keep the distance. There we go. Are those the VTOL that Battle Armor can fire from? Oh, you're talking about the Utake? That's a great question. I don't know. I don't think so. I don't know. Anything bigger than a locust will, but not them. All right. Well, we lucked out then. We super lucked out. What is this guy? I don't remember anymore. You see the pack rat? Oh, it's the pack rat. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. We can get in on this. Not like our battle armor can right now anyways. Shot. All right, we did it. Beautiful. 20 in the back. Thinking of VTOL that battle armor can fire from and putting Marauder battle armor inside of them. Heck yes, that's a great idea. Vedette. All right, coming around. Here we go. We got the line. I should probably really move Deaths out of the way instead of shooting where he can get hit because of friendly fire. But Deaths is lucky. 10 times support. Oh, that would be amazing. All right, bring her around. Here we go. Deaths got it. Shot. Well, he's panicking. That's all we can really ask for, right? Ready for orders. What do we got? Not this. To the pack rat. Confirm. What's that sound? <laughs> That's the sound of an explosion of our enemies. I like it. I dig it. Chaparral. Uh, That's probably not smart. We can probably lock him, though. I'm on my way. No, we cannot. He's just out of range. Hold. Amiel. All right. Come on, Amiel. Get in there. Attack ground behind him. Nope. Not with Amiel on the field. Amiel's ready. Get in there, Amiel. I believe in you, buddy. I believe. I believe. Like a hero. In three, two, and one. Go fire true, buddy. Uh-oh. <laughs> We're in so much trouble. Hang tight, Amuel. Uh, all right, Scimitar, Scimitar. We got this. We got this. You can do it. You can do it. Please don't hit Amuel. Oh, this is a bad idea. This is a really bad idea, actually. I'm... Just missiles. Oh, boy. I'm fine. Make it a Ravager battle armor. Oh, my gosh. Ravagers are amazing. Absolutely love Ravagers. You know who can do it? The Omega can. If we didn't have to fly a certain minimum distance. Oh god. Maybe we can't. Oh no. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> Do we have to shoot from the... Oh no. Oh no. Come on. What's the... Alright, we'll come in from this way. Ravager has room for that many. I don't know. We'll push him back to at least initiative six. And he's out! Heck yes! All right! Well done, bunnies! That sure put a hole in warrior house Imara defenses. All right! Total win, total win! That's what we're talking about. Will the bunny league suffer a pilot loss? That is a resounding no. Congratulations to those who had the faith. 161. We've got one more mission in us. Let's take a look. Flamer, HVACs, those come from those turrets. SRM, Pharaoh, Fibrous, absolutely. Locust, we can get a real locust, not our intern locust. Okay, you know what? I'll get a... Let's try for the non-intern locust. Three, two, and one. Oh, we have another three out of four, but... <laughs> oh, it's not going to end. All right, so we got an HVAC 2. We've got two light machine guns, SRM-6, a new core, ammunition as well for the HVAC. This is fantastic. All right, beautiful. Well, it couldn't get any better than that. Other than if we if we got the fourth part of an actual mech. Heck yes, let's go. Hiring home. We've got 
all mech pilots. So no Omni pilots at all, which is unfortunate. Drat. I mean, obviously this is very good once you get to the point where you do have mechs and battle armor, but before then, not so helpful. But thank you for letting, reminding me to check. So in the store, the bunnies were asking about resupply. This is one of the ones that can support your, your crew in the field. And I'm just refreshing myself just to see if there's anything that is going to help us out. Not really, because I totally forgot we're still in all of our Vs, which I actually kind of dig. Let's go over to the mech bay. So three out of four of a commando, three out of four of a locust, three out of four of a stinger, three out of four of a shadowhawk, three out of four of a Hephaestus, two out of four of a panther, two out of four of a javelin, and a singleton of a really cool blackjack. Okay, good to know. Is the battle armor still okay? Battle armor still fine. Beautiful. Barracks, let's apply the points. If we can get sensor locks, it's going to make this a lot faster, more efficient. So we'll go in like so. Four across before assigning skills. Depth has everything. We got HD. Oh, man. Dud. I guess we'll get the point here. Or better yet, actually, if we can get him the defensive, that's awesome. And hold. We've got Omega. I mean, Omega can get sensor lock. I mean, that'll be helpful for now. And then since he's in the air, we'll give him sure movement. Although I guess that doesn't really work with the Vs, though. Ronin. Ah, Ronin. All right. Beautiful. So we got sensor lock. Fantastic. How's serve? And served is now all 2-4. Beautiful. So on the next one, he's going to be able to get that lock as well. Fantastic. So let's just double check. I don't think we're doing any repairs. Anybody's out? No. So command center and see what we got. Yeah. Guns and guts. When you salvage mechs in this mod, does it come stripped or with a full? You can... I believe you can choose. I believe you're able to choose. And come partially equipped. Yeah. Because there are options you can choose, right? So solo dual, no. Mopping up battle in a polar biome. One and a half skull. Challenge accepted. Capture base. Recovery escort. I want to just do another straight battle. I think that's probably the best we're fighting against the pirates might find more periphery tech 211 we are not completely in the red so i'm gonna go full salvage this time because so far we've been going two pick nine which has not worked out super super great for us but that's okay amiel's actually healed this time everything is looking dandy all right bunnies last battle of the night one skull difficulty battle in a polar biome raven has reminded me I have forgotten because this feels really weird. So, um, it feels weird to ask for support, but we are trying to grow the Bunny League by hitting a thousand subs, which is like the Twitch equivalent of follow. So it's free. It's not something you have to pay for. So if you'd like to, and you're not already, if you want to go to our YouTube channel and we'd really appreciate it if you could throw us a sub, that'd be fantastic. Anyway, last mission here we go thank you so much for the commercial break this is the last known position of the enemy lands bunnies advance and get eyes on them let's see how badly damaged they really are grunting bunnies olivera out hey mercs how about you off today and we call this even you don't need to be involved in this i'd rather not have to kill you if i don't have to so turn around and go home and we'll forget all about it all right, here we are, and we have not preloaded because we totally forgot again. All right, well, we're just going to reserve down to one. Looks like they're right on the other side, right? Is it a singleton? Okay. Oh, they're in a bowl. This is like Jurassic Park. They're inside of a crater, and we're on the opposite side. We don't have side slip or anything like that, but you know what this calls for? A little Yutake scouting and a lot of artillery. Heck yes. Oh, thank you, Osmondius. I really appreciate it. It it helps a lot. It helps a lot. Apparently, something happens at the thousand threshold where you can actually start earning fractions of a penny from ads that people watch already or something like that. Raven's kind of my pseudo business manager, and she's doing a fantastic job. So, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go in and mount on up in the Yutake and let's go. Thank you again. Much appreciated, John. Thank you, Crossbow. All right, let's do it. Here we go. And we will hold for Amiel. We are now mounted up. We are not preloaded, but that's okay. We are down to one. We'll start with Omega. Let's get sight on. What do they got? We have a fire starter. All right. I don't think we have any parts of the fire starter yet. And we've got 
Oh, how uncanny. The exact commando that we have three of four of. So at the very least, we're going to be able to get ourselves a brand new commando foot. I'm, I'm going to call I'm going to call it footsies from now on. It's the FT. So yeah, that's what it is. It's a foot. Let's go in and lock out the fire starter. Bring that down to one. Hopefully he's not. Oh, and he's is this fire starter in general immune to sensor lock? Does it have an electronic countermeasure suite or something like that? Because that's the second time in a row. That's kind of crazy. Or just uncanny, right? So our scimitar is... Oh, cool. Samir dropped us on a... <laughs> Again? Well, let's careful maneuver. Let's go, bunnies. Here we go. We're walking oh, down boy, the mountain. Brutalize that commando. You can earn a fraction of a penny on the hundred of dollars they make. Yeah, that's right. We could earn a fraction of a penny. It's like a really a fraction of a penny. It's not even... I think it takes however many thousand views or something before you can get a full penny. <laughs> like, I don't know. 28, 16. Let's go for that fire starter shot out. We actually connect with this guy and blow his leg wide open. Absolutely incredible. We got depths here. He's also... Oh, are you serious? He's also stuck? Our poor hover tanks. We need... We need tracked Vs. That's what we need. We need some tracked Vs on this one. I get the feeling Darius is slowly recruiting Samir. Why? Why? He's turned against us, bunnies. Got it. Max B, and hold. And chaparral. Well, this we don't actually have to be too, you know. We can go wherever we want. 25. Going wide. Is it just the two of them? We may have super lucked out if that's the case. Because we can really isolate. Let's see what they do. I mean, obviously they can see us now. So many lasers, and he misses with all of them. Heck yes. What do you mean, turning against us? He always was. What are you talking about? Darius, they're saying that you were always against them. I am? Yes. I mean, you always give us bad intelligence. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Oops. Well, I guess he is, Dream Mag. It seems like you're right. I'm sorry. I, I sometimes wish that it were not the case, so I had to ask. And next, oh, another fire. I know, seriously, another fire start. It's incredible. Really, it is. Three evasion. He has, he's all the way on three. And it connects, but we do have sensor lock on this, so we can run away and still be useful, which is fantastic. What Let's get fuck? Omega in there. Better yet, no, we'll be able to drop right. some battle armor on him, send it. Although, actually, sensor lock's not going to do anything to him. We already established that, like, three times. And we got Amiel on the drop. Although before we do that, maybe we should, you know, do some more explosive things to it first, yeah? Oh, they've got more. They have to have more out there. It's not just these two, because otherwise the computer wouldn't be thinking, because they've already done their thing. Yep. And they whiff it. I have no idea what that is. Maybe it's a Centurion or something like that. I saw an AC. I saw missiles. Who knows? That's pretty exciting. Right. We got debts. He's got that angle. 20. I mean, we'll, On my way. Double time. we'll try to get lucky here. Let's see how you like this. If we could only drop his evasion, if we had Mexico kick, that would be amazing. And do a hold, hold, hold. Ready for orders. Served Wait. HB. Why am I right. in HB's copy? ready. Smart. He's got that arrow four. Oh my gosh. 20%. Yes. Okay, that's that's pretty good, good softening. Go. We'll take that. We got the line. Shot wide. And then now Amiel's clear. On you, Although we got served cold first. All right, everyone get your pot shot in. <laughs> Very low chances, but we'll take it. Hold. Oh, it's the fire starter S1. We want more parts of this one. It's the one with endo. Well, we've got... I don't remember if we have any parts of this, actually. I wish we did. Actually, I don't think we have any parts of this. So we're going to have to get be very, very gentle. You heard us, Amiel. Be very gentle. Here we go. He's going. I heard the ping to the leg. Connect to the leg. Lost evasion. That's huge. And guns. And we got a breach. We got a breach. Let's go in and extract Amiel because we is now lost evasion. Oh, although, who's moving on nine? No, actually, we stay. We stay where we are. Hold. 
I never know what he's doing in there. And guns? I see orange. Oh, he was not gentle, but I'm seeing bleeding and two activations. And he is gone. Three salvageable parts from Amiel. Absolutely incredible job by Amiel. Amazing comeback from his time in the med bay. Amazing. Yep, for mixed assembly two is necessary. Oh, we are we are going. We got three on the board and we've got three pick. I think three pick something. We got three pick something. It's amazing. Oh, three pick 11 or no, no, we don't. We've got two. I don't even know what we got anymore. All right, we're moving. I think we might be able to just at least lock from here. So we're moving to the right. That was gentle enough. It definitely was out of sensor lock range. Omega. Let's hold. On six. What do they got out here? So they only have three. So that was 33%. It was one third of the lance. So I think this is the last one right here. All right. Shadowhawk. We got a Shadowhawk on tap. We actually have three quarters of a periphery howitzer Shadowhawk of some kind. Some variant like that. I don't know if they're compatible. But I wouldn't imagine that they're not compatible. Battle Lord. 40. Shot the Shadowhawk. And super wide. Well, we can always grab the three parts and use one part. We already have to make the best one. That's right. The bunnies are smart indeed. You need that commando part. We need all the parts right now. In we go. And shot. Let's see how you like this. Wow, that's pretty darn good. So we get you? potentially two full mechs. Plus the fire starter parts for the majority. Well, let's not count our eggs before they are hatched. Because after all, we have not been the luckiest when grabbing all of the parts. If that Shadow Hawk hadn't moved, that would be a hit. It's true. 25 and go. Oh, wait. Did I just shoot at the commando? Oh, no. Ugh. I did not mean to shoot over there. That was my fault. My bad. Hold. Here comes the commando. Small movement. That's a lot of lasers. Oh my god. Wow. We can only take one salvo like that. Let's get our Yutake out of there. And let's pick up Amiel. Omega. Amiel is... We need a search and rescue. Where's Amiel? <laughs> oh, Amiel's floating in the sky. All right, well, let's go over here. He's like way up here. Why is Amiel? How did you get up there? That's incredible, man. Battletech VTOLs are cheese. They're incredible. And Amiel on the mount. He's right up where... Can you even mount from there? Oh, wow, that's incredible. Okay, cool. <laughs> Amiel in the sky. As long as you can keep it in speed. Well, I, I mean, we have been hit. It was not pretty, Lornalt. We did have a breach and we had to run away, but for the most part, I think you are correct, yes. I don't know if we're close enough to keep locking. That's the same, but we'll lock him anyway. Okay, perfect, perfect. Commander. You know what? I think we just chill with all the other bunnies. Artillery it is, as it has been. Let's reposition. Get a little higher each time. Shot. Good connect. A little bit of a hit to the head there. Waiting on you, Commander. Vedette is over. We got more shots. We got more green. Metal to the metal. AC5 to the rear. And send it. Affirmative. To the leg. Smart. 37. Shot Time to, to Commando. Ball. Gentle. There it is. There it... Oh, oh, never mind. Not gentle. We kind of... Oh, wait, no, we already have parts of this. What are we talking about? Oh, he's going to bleed out. That's great. All right, perfect. Amiel, hold. Hold the game. On eight. He's coming up. Stand up. He's got Malices. I forgot. We can totally destroy this guy. It's okay. Ugh. He's basically a commando version, like a chemical liquid commando version of a hunchy. The disco back with all those lasers. Lock up Shadowhawk to zero. We only need one part. Heck yes. That's what I like to hear. And that Yutake. Interesting being geothermal with this. 
Uh, sure. Oh, that was gentle. Is he out? And out he goes. Beautiful. Three salvageable parts. Amazing. What do we got? We got Amiel as well. Let's hold, hold, hold. Let's see what he does. This is his last chance at redemption, this Shadowhawk. He's thinking. It's an important decision. Wow. Not bad. <laughs> Amul in the sky with mortars. That's right. All right, let's do this. Let's wrap this up, bunnies. Let's wrap this up. What do we got? Shot from above. Switch over to arrow four. Wait, but why am I in a coffee? Is this and shot. Good connect. There it is. There it is. Standing by. Hold. I hear you. Going wide. Going turbo. Shot to the side. No sweat. Good connect. All evasion gone. Beautiful. That one evasion has been wiped. Go ahead and double turn this guy. We are in the geothermal. Hopefully, it won't destroy it. I don't know how lethal it is to, you know, little guys like this. And swarm it. Here we go. This isn't XCOM. <laughs> Hold. Guns. It hit the right torso. We're going to hold position for Amiel. He's taken down a Shadowhawk before. Kick to the leg. And guns. To the arm. Okay, so he's still in there. Let's go in and reserve down to one. I want to see what happens with this guy. Nine evasion. Oh my god, I didn't realize it. Having a hot foot it, yeah. Oh, he's going down, he's going down. What's going on in there? Amuel... Amiel, you okay? Amiel's still fine. Well, he won't be fine if I, you know, do this, but we'll just, we'll have a little patience. How about that? <laughs> Hold. Keeping my heat low. So far, so good. Well, let's go away and we'll come right back. We just want to maintain speed. I can't believe we can hit nine evasion with this. Ooh, I'm so tempted. Like, sometimes you gotta just for sit straight to the head. Oh, we hit the head. Okay, hold. Oh, hold, hold, hold. And Amiel, go. Come on, Amiel. Come on, Amiel. Come on, Amiel. He has one more injury. Gentle. <laughs> that was not gentle, Emil. He had one injury and all his body parts. Wop wop. That's all the survivors destroyed, bunnies. Well done. Ah, oh, dread. Both a win and a loss at the same time. But will the Bunny League suffer a pilot loss? That is a no. Congratulations to those who end the faith. We'll take one last look at the storage bay. Actually, we can do it from this screen. I totally forgot. We don't even have to leave the loot screen. That's amazing. So let's see what we got. 31,000 in the positive. No damage, no repairs, no injuries. The commando, we've got the last part of it. AC5, small chem lasers, guardian ECM, fire starter parts. Oh gosh. Should we... No, we want to guarantee that we get the commando. If we look at storage right now, you can actually see it all here, which I totally didn't know until the bunnies told me. So we get the last part of the commando. We can get one more part of the Shadowhawk. I don't know if they're compatible. I guess the smart thing is probably to get the Shadowhawk part just because of this. Oh, no way. Hang on. Oh, my God. Is this showing me only what it's compatible with? Wow, wait a minute. So if I go Shadowhawk, take a look at the lower left here. Oh my god. This mod is so fully featured. This is ridiculous. It's actually snapping to the compatible part 
inside of the storage. I'm done. This is honestly, this is like one of the best mods out there. If not, anyway, here we go. Three, two, and one. So basically we have a full commando. We have a full Shadowhawk. We've got half of an amazing fire starter. That's incredible. An AC5, AMS, thank the bunny god. Guardian ECM, what a haul. That is incredible. So we can now get rid of the bunny intern. It's gone. So what are our mechs now? We can now put together a commando. You know this one. Fresh from your friends at Periphery Arms Incorporated comes this commando, affectionately named the Frozen Tempest. Based on the Blazing Inferno, the Frozen Tempest uses a battery of chemical lasers for firepower, while the prototype XL engine keeps it all running. Where the Blazing Inferno uses used standard lasers and was famous for overheating in the thick of combat, the Frozen Tempest chemical lasers run as cool as a glass of ice water in the Arctic, ensuring you will never overheat again. P.A.I. We hit it out of the park again just for you. And of course, we also have a Shadowhawk. There it is. Artillery brings to mind a certain image of shelling helpless opponents who can't even begin to fight back against their tormentor. I already like how this sounds. However, the new howitzer artillery system is not like that as it requires direct line of sight to be effective. Are you... You can't tease me like that yet. <laughs> Still, the weapon is very powerful. As the Shadowhawk 6PA illustrates, armed with a Howitzer 8 as well as an SRM2 and twin medium lasers, the 6PA has a weapon for everyone. Prototype and a steel helps pay for the Howitzer's tonnage, while five jump jets keep it mobile and ensures it can draw a bead on the enemy every time. These all read like some kind of sales pitch. I love it, yeah? At least it's not the quick sell version. This thing is a beast. All right, so here are our first two mechs of this entire career. That is incredible. Well, my gosh, we've done a lot. Bunnies, thanks so much for hanging out with me tonight. What a start from rags to more, or I guess more luxurious ones. We have come a long way. So we started with all these. Now we've got two mechs added to the fold. Granted, they're periphery versions, but they're all very, very unique. I, we've never had them before. We've got the Commando Foot, and we've got the Shadowhawk with a howitzer on its shoulder. That's pretty darn cool. On YouTube, we'll be playing Battle Fantasy Challenge 4. Uh, we've got our new Bard Juggernaut with... It's not quite 20 AMS, but it's a lot of AMS. And also, just a reminder from Raven, if you would be so kind with the... We are trying to hit 1,000 subs on YouTube. That would be amazing if you could head on over and just check if you've done so already. Either way, I really, really appreciate the support. Thank you so much. I had a total blast. I hope you did as well. And I can't wait to get into the next one video. Have a good night.